Kirby is a liar. Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin, there's a problem at the City Hall Square. It's on fire. Fire? In the square? All right, send the rescue team right away. This morning's been a busy one. Emergency! Emergency! Brody just reported that there's a huge fire down at the City Hall Square. Be hurried to the City Hall Square right away. Right, Jin. <laughs> Where'd he say the fire was? I'm sure the City Hall Square. Yeah. Whoa, do you think Rhodey might have told a lie? <laughs> wow, that was fun. <laughs> what? That was a prank call? Mm -hmm. We went to the City Hall Square, but it was normal. We could get a prank call at any time. How do we handle that? Actually, whenever a call comes in, there's no way to tell if it's a prank or not. You're right. It's not like we can ignore a report. This is a problem. It really is. Hmm. <laughs> huh? There's Mr. Musty and Minnie. And the prince lived happily ever after. <laughs> Tell me another. <laughs> you like stories, eh? Uh-huh. Let me see. Which story next? Okay. So once upon a time... Mr. Oh. Uh, you've got to listen to me. Brody, what happened? It's terrible. An accident. Mr. Wheeler fell off the splashdown bridge and he got hurt. What? Mr. Wheeler? Minnie, I'll have to tell you that story later. Get for me! I'm coming too! <laughs> hmm. A bite! It's big! Huh? What is that? Mr. Wheeler! Uh. Mr. Musty! Uh. I heard you fell off the bridge. Is everything all right? I fell? Not me. But Rhodey told us so. Mm -hmm. Huh? Where's Rhodey? Hmm, <laughs> dear. Rhodey must have told a lie. Lie? Now I'm wondering if Rhodey told me a lie. He lied to you too? A real whopper. Rhodey told me that this spot was a great place to catch all kinds of big fish. Look what I caught. Oh huh? boy, too bad. Such a liar. <laughs> huh? Well, I've been driving more than I thought. I guess I need a charge. Charging station, here I come. Huh? Isn't that Mr. Whooper? Hmm. I think I'll go and have some fun with him. <sighs> What's wrong with me? There's something wrong when I try to steer. It doesn't feel right. Mr. Wooper! Huh? Help! 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 I'm coming! Rescue team and hurry up! Rescue team? Okay. Yeah. Brody, hurry! Right! I forgot that my battery's dead! Somebody help me! Somebody! Please help! Anyone help me, please! Hey, 
you hear that? I heard. Let's go check it out. We'd better hurry. <gasps> Minnie! Mr. Musty! Rudy? Huh. At it again. Minnie, I need your help. Mr. Wooper's in a lot of trouble. See, if we don't call the rescue team now, the water tank may fall right down on Mr. Wooper's head. So why don't you just report it yourself? I ran out of electricity and I can't move. Really? <laughs> Do you think we're going to fall for that? Come on, Grandpa. Let's just go. It's real. I mean it this time. <sighs> Mr. Musty, you've got to believe me. Mr. Wooper's in a whole lot of trouble. No lie. <laughs> You've got to believe me! <laughs> Grandpa, it's just another lie. <laughs> Rescue Team Jim! Jim! Oh, Mr. Musty! How can I help you? Rudy told me about Mr. Wooper. He got into an accident over by 16th Street. What? <sighs> Not again. Rudy just made a prank call to us this morning. Hmm. This time, I think Rhodey is telling the truth. Jin, I think you should send the rescue team right away. Oh. Guess so. I'll call the rescue team right now. Emergency! Emergency! Mr. Woofer's been in an accident over by 16th Street. Team, please proceed to location right away. Right, Jin. Jin. Hurry up and secure the water tank. Got it! Let's get down there and lift Mr. Wooper. Let's, Let's go! go. <laughs> We're here! Roy, for some reason my wheels aren't working. Take it easy. We'll help you up here. <laughs> Ready? I'm ready! Me too! On the count of three. One, two, three! Kelly, <laughs> 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 hurry up! Ready? Let's try it one more time. Here we go! What? When you were asking for help, that was a lie? Yeah. Whew. That's a relief. The way you were carrying on, I thought you were in really big trouble. I am so sorry. I didn't think it would end like this. I never wanted to put you in danger. Oh, <laughs> Rudy, this was hard. <laughs> but think of what you've learned. If you keep <laughs> telling lies, someday no one will believe you, even the times when you're telling the truth. Right. Mr. Musty believed you. But just imagine the opposite. Mr. Wooper would have been in a lot more trouble. Yeah. Promise. I'll never tell lies anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa, mm -hmm. I have 
a question. How did you know that Rhodey was telling the truth? It's my age. As one gets older, one hopes to gain more wisdom. And that happens to remind me of a story that I would like to tell Rhodey, if he doesn't mind. Not at all. Good, thank you. Now, let's see. A long time ago, there was a boy who lied. Wait, that story sounds like it's about me. Please stop. Uh -huh. It's embarrassing. Oh, 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 oh. Let me finish. No, I don't want to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> Greedy Mr. Wheeler. This tire is so old, I should throw it out. Mr. Wheeler? Huh? Hi, Spooky. And hi to you. Oh, throwing away that tire, are you? Yes, why? I'll take it for you. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> wow, this is fun. Put that down right now. <laughs> huh? Why? I may have use for this tire later. Huh? <clears throat> I thought he was throwing it away. <clears throat> it's done. Hmm. Nice picture. Hmm. Huh? Mr. Wheeler. Oh, hi. Hi. What can I do for you? Well, I was wondering if I could borrow your hammer. My hammer? I'm afraid not. I happen to be using it right now. May I borrow it after you're done with it? I'll just wait right here. Huh? I don't care whether you wait there or not. I'll use it today, tomorrow, and so on. I'll keep using it forever. <gasps> what a meanie. Hmm. Hmm. Huh? 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 Stop that noise right now! Huh? Uh, Mr. Wheeler! Uh, what do you think you're doing? <laughs> the drain pipes need repair. Not while I'm around. Do it on your own time. What? I can't think with all this noise. What? Now where did it go? Huh? What's wrong, Jin? It seems all of my tools have just disappeared. Now that's strange. Hey, hey friends. friends. Huh? Hello. Jin, huh? what's the matter? Her tools have disappeared again. I can't find them anywhere. They couldn't have just run away. You didn't lend them to someone, did you? You know, I think you are right. Who did I lend them to? I can't think. Just think hard. But I can't recall. But, Jin, you have work to do today. Mm -hmm. Maybe you should borrow some tools from someone else. Mr. Wheeler's got tools. He's got lots of them. Huh. I'll go ask. Hmm. That's great, Helly. <laughs> I hope Spooky finally learned his lesson. I don't like lending anything to anybody. Mr. Wheeler was so mean huh? to me. All I did was ask if I could borrow his hammer. Too bad. He acted like asking was the worst thing in the whole world. That's nothing. He wouldn't even let me take an old tire that he was throwing away. He wouldn't let us finish our work. Selfish. And greedy. And nasty. Oh, yeah, you're right. What was that, huh? Oh, Mr. Mr. Wheeler? Wheeler? Why would you call me such nasty names like that? What's wrong with me not giving out all my things? I think Mr. Wheeler is angry. Let's go! The nerve. I'm greedy and nasty and only think of myself? Now I've heard everything. Mr. Wheeler? Huh? Hi there! Oh, Hallie. Good to see you. Uh, I need your opinion. Sure. About what? Listen to this. Spooky kept begging me to give him one of my old tires. I said no because it's already mine. Oh, I totally forgot I lent this to you. Oh, dear. I hope I didn't cause you any trouble. Not at all. You returned it just in time. That's a relief. It's a great tool. Thanks, Jen. I'll see you later. Take care, Stacy. That's right. I shouldn't have sent Helly out. If they call me names like greedy and nasty, isn't that over the top? 
What's wrong with not lending any of my things to other people? Then I know I'll always have them. Well, everything you're saying to me seems to make sense. Yes, uh, but? I think it might be more helpful to your friends if you lent out your things when they're not in use. Helping each other is good. You might need to borrow something from someone someday. You never know. What? That will never happen. <laughs> but, uh... Of all the nerve. By the way, what did you want? I came here to say hello. What, what happened? happened? I couldn't huh? even ask Mr. Wheeler if oh. I could borrow any tools. It's all right, Helly. Stacy had my tool. She gave it back to me, and I've already finished my work. That's great. What a relief. Honestly, I'm worried about Mr. Wheeler's anger. One of these days, it's going to really upset his friends. I think you're right. One of these days, Mr. Wheeler's going to need help from someone, I'm sure. Yeah. Hmm. Six, seven... Huh? Now, what was that? Huh? What's this? Hmm. I'll be. It's a shingle from the roof. I guess I should fix this now. Oh, dear. I'll need to borrow a ladder to get up on the roof. Where should I get it? I'll use it today, tomorrow, and so on. I'll keep using it forever. What's wrong with me not giving out all my things? Dear. Perhaps I shouldn't have gotten so angry. Eh, leave it to me. Uh -huh. Ah, there it is. It's higher up here than I thought it would be. Be careful, Wheeler. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh! oh. My hammer! Huh? Where'd that come from? Huh? It's Mr. Wheeler's. How did it get here? Help me! Huh? Oh. Hey, Mr. Wheeler! I can't move! Ah! Cleanie, I'm gonna fall down the chimney! What am I going to do? Hold on! I'll call the rescue team! Hello, rescue team. This is Jen. Jen! Mr. Wheeler's in trouble! Mr. Wheeler? You'll need to give me the details. Emergency! Emergency! Mr. Wheeler was repairing the roof on his shop and got stuck in the chimney! Proceed to Mr. Wheeler's shop immediately. Right, right Jen! Take it easy. We'll get you out of there. Helly, get ready to pull Mr. Wheeler out of the chimney. Got it. Roy, you get the rescue ladder ready. And Amber, you prepare the air mattress. Got, Got it. it. Look straight ahead. 
if you say so. Oh, oh, oh. Huh? Good job. All set, Roy. Right. I'll bring the crane down. <laughs> it won't be much longer. Almost there. <laughs> <sighs> I'm glad you're all right, Mr. Wheeler. <laughs> Me too. Tell us, why did you go up the chimney in the first place? Well, I needed to go up and repair the roof, but I didn't have a ladder, and I couldn't borrow anyone's. What could I do? Mr. Wheeler! Huh? What are you three doing here? We heard that you got in an accident, so we were worried about you. Uh... We hope you didn't get hurt. Thank goodness I'm fine. Thank you. You're all so kind. I have been acting greedy and nasty. I'm so sorry for what I've done. Don't worry. We're just glad to see you back on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Cleanie, do you still need a hammer? Why, you can borrow mine. Really? Thanks. How nice of you. Enjoy. Bruner, Poke, you can work in front of my store as long as you want. Wow, you mean it? <laughs> yes, of course. And you, Spooky, hmm. <clears throat> play as much as you like. Oh, awesome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, oops. <laughs> Guess I'm stuck again. <laughs> <laughs> I like the circus. Ladies and gentlemen, now for the stunt you've all been waiting for, the Triple Somersault Leap! And now, Broomstown Circus's final amazing <laughs> stunt! Uh, <laughs> Spooky successfully lands the jump! <laughs> Spooky, you look just like those circus cars! <laughs> I may not know much, but I'm good at copying stunts. Hey, guys! Huh? Oh. Check this oh. out! Oh. 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 Ta-da! Wow, Cap! That was great! It really looks like you're doing one of those circus tricks. <laughs> yeah, that was awesome. I want to try it. <laughs> okay, now I just need to make the turn. <laughs> <laughs> Spooky, it needs some work. Uh, I mean, it looks so easy. See you later. Okay, bye. Stacy! Huh? Hello. Hi there, Helly. I came to check if the emergency phone I fixed is still working. Hmm. Uh. It sounds fine. Oh, that's good. All right, uh, I finally huh? did it. Uh. Stacy, I did it. I really did it. <laughs> Hello, Helly. What is it that you can do? I mastered a cool circus stunt. Huh. A stunt? <laughs> Since he's been back from the circus, he's been practicing their stunts. Spooky. Copying circus stunts is dangerous. You could hurt yourself. Don't worry. The one I'm working on isn't very difficult. <gasps> Goodbye, you guys. See you huh? soon. Where are you going now? I have to show everybody else my stunt. See you guys. <gasps> Spooky. Oh, dear. <sighs> Coming in. Hello, Hello Helly. What's everybody doing here? Jin's about to unveil a new invention, and we're all waiting to see it. Invention? Ta-da! Here it is. Oh. Uh, 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 how do you like it? Uh, what, what is, is that, that thing? thing? It's the risky, tricky circus bike. It, it looks, looks dangerous. dangerous. Uh, uh. 
Jin, get down! Uh, you're going to get hurt! No, uh, I won't! I, I can handle this! Uh, 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 uh. Jin, you really should get off! That doesn't look safe! Uh, no, I, I, I got it now! Uh, oh, uh, 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 Jin! <laughs> Are you all right? Uh, I'm not all right at all. Uh, you, you can, can really, really do it now? I sure can. Watch this. That was great. Sure. For an easy stunt, I happen to have learned a trickier one. <laughs> really? Show me. I want to see. Observe. <laughs> wow, that looks really fun! It feels like you're flying through the air! <laughs> oh, yeah? Let me try it! <laughs> I did it! That wasn't bad, Spooky! <laughs> wow, you two are really great! It's just like watching a real circus! Really? You think we're just as good as them? <laughs> that makes me want to try something even more dangerous. Huh? Yeah, what is it? Huh? Cap, huh? that's what our next stunt can be. What? Are you serious? Oh, yeah. The triple somersault leap. You in? Uh, <laughs> well, oh. How am I supposed to wear this for a whole month? You should have uh -huh. stopped when we told you to stop. Mm. But I never thought that I would get hurt like this. I guess I should have practiced more. No matter how much you practice, bicycle tricks are very dangerous. He's right. You know, you need special training for stunts like that. Anyway, you were very lucky. Just take care of your leg. You have to let it heal. I know. It's just that my poor bicycle... What a day. I guess the circus is really popular with everyone in town. Why? Why? What, what happened? happened? Well, earlier, Spooky was copying circus stunts, so I told him to be careful. Spooky needs to learn. Next time you see him, be sure to tell him what happened to my poor leg. Ouch! <laughs> Jim! <Jen. Jen>. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's the moment you've been waiting for. It's the amazing triple somersault leap! Do -do 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 -do. Cap, come on, let's go! Uh, uh -uh. Aw, is he too scared to jump? <laughs> There's no way! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, spooky! Huh? Uh, 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 uh. Just hold still, Spooky. 
It's shaking a lot. Yeah, I know. Mm. They're here. Spooky, it's all right. We're here to get you back down. Amber, can you get the air mat ready? Yes! Heli, fasten the safety belt to Spooky. Roy, we'll need your crane. Got, Got it! it. Hmm. Uh, Spooky, don't worry. We're almost done. Uh-huh. We're set, Polly! Good! Roy, get the crane up. Okay. Whoa, Helly! We've got it. Just see the spooky. Spooky, don't be scared. Uh -huh. Roy, you're up. You can bring him down now. Okay. <sighs> Thank you, guys. <sighs> hey, you guys, look <gasps> at me. <gasps> look at me flying. Whoa. Spooky. Spooky, stop playing around. It's dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Ah, I'm safe now. Hmm. What? Huh? You were trying to do that stunt from the circus. Yeah. yeah. Spooky, you told me you wouldn't try the dangerous ones. I know. But each time I mastered a new stunt, I wanted to try one that was better. We didn't know it would be this dangerous. Yeah. Even so, those cars, they spend years in training. You can't expect to learn a stunt like that in just a single day. Now I know. I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Uh -uh. Good. You don't want to end up like Jin, do you? What? Did she get hurt? Mm-hmm. She hurt her leg on a circus bike she made. Now she's stuck in a cast for a whole month. <gasps> That's a awful. Month? Whoa, <gasps> a month? I would never last. I won't try stunts like that again. Neither will we. <laughs> <laughs>
We can make some kind of safety map of the woods. A safety map? If we carefully mark all the caution areas and the do not enter areas, don't you think it will lower the chances of accidents? That's a really brilliant plan. Let's go. Time to check out the woods. <laughs> Big, we might need a warning sign on here. <laughs> Dumpy? Oh, uh, yeah? Do you want to play a game with me? Uh, no, I can't today. I have this appointment I have to go to. Really? You do? Um, I also have an appointment to go to. Huh. Hey, Poke! Uh -huh. What do you say? Uh -huh. Huh? What? Not you, too. Oh. <sighs> hmm. Huh. <laughs> oh, wow. Would you look at the time? Yeah, the time. Wow. Oh. Oh. Hey, Poke. You're going, too? Uh-huh. Poke? Yeah. Huh? What's going on? said they were busy. Where are they going? They came to play without me. This is so fun. Without Bruner, we can all take turns with the ball. So fun. It should always be just us. What did they say? Hey. Let's start another round. Oh. They're really playing without me. <laughs> hey, Poke, toss it to me. Uh -oh. Uh, don't worry, I'll get it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> There it is. <laughs> I wonder oh. what's taking so long. Uh -huh. Help! Huh? Somebody! Uh, Something uh, must have happened to him. Oh. Max! Help! Hey, Max! Uh -huh. Huh? Somebody! We're here, oh. Max! Oh. Mm. Hello! I'm sinking! Uh, Poke, help us! Uh, 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 Pull harder! <sighs> I guess they don't want to play with me because I don't share the ball. <sighs> Somebody help! Hmm? Hey, who help said that? I'm coming! Dump, where are you? Down here! <sighs> We're going under! We're going under! Stay right there! I'll call the rescue team! This is a fallen rock area, and the wild animal preserve goes here. That means this goes here. Huh? Hmm? Jim, so how's the map? Well, all right. Except for the cabin. We need to check that out. Really? Well, I'm happy to go and investigate. Awesome. Well, then, 
I think I'm gonna call it a day. Huh? Hello, this is Jen speaking. Jen, emergency! Max and Dump fell into a quagmire! Oh, oh no. no! We're right near the cabin in Owl Wood! Please come quick! All right, I'm sending the rescue team now! Ahead and see what you can find out. I'm on it. Oh, hey, Poke, please don't lose your grip. Look out. Hold on, you guys. I'm going to scoop out this mud. Bruner, please don't, or you'll be in danger too. I'm okay. Uh -oh. I... I'm going under. No, no Max. Max. Huh? Oh. Helly! The rescue team is coming. Try and hang on, guys. They're here. Roy, you go get Max. Amber, Bruner is yours. And I'll go get Dump. Let's go do this! <laughs> Dump! Into the mud! Runner! Uh, no. yeah. uh, help me! Hang on! <laughs> Almost there, Max! Hey, guys, are you all right? <laughs> yeah. <Yes. laughs> this should be on our map. I never even knew that this swamp was here. Definitely. Luckily, everybody's safe now. Who knows what would have happened if Bruner hadn't shown up? We're really grateful, Bruner. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And we're sorry. We shouldn't have excluded you from our ball game. Ah, oh, no. That was all my fault. How come? Did something happen? Kind of. Bruner had a tendency to keep the ball all to himself. We all came out here secretly to play without him. That's when we fell in. Sorry. He's right. I won't be a ball hog anymore. All right, then. It sounds like everything's back to normal. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, has anybody seen the ball? Don't worry. It's here, safe and sound. Helly, here, pass it to me. I'm all good. Hey. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> I guess when I see the ball, I just can't help myself. <laughs> 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 Time? This is extremely detailed work and something that can't be rushed. Hello. Huh? Holy! What's that you're working on? Ellie needed some new goggles. I'm installing a new infrared function. <laughs> wow, that's awesome. I'm going to town to patrol. Show me when they're finished, okay? Okay, Polly. 
Grandpa, what do you want for your birthday? No, uh, oh, I don't need any presents, sweetheart. Sure you do. Everyone needs presents for their birthday. How about flowers? <laughs> flowers would be fine. And a nice balloon. Hmm, balloons are good. Oh, you're just saying everything sounds good. <laughs> yes. No! Uh, mm. Are you all right? I'm okay, but my eyesight isn't what it used to be. Just be careful. I will. Uh. I have to go see Mr. Wheeler. I'll see you at home afterwards. Bye. <laughs> Look out! No! Not again! <laughs> be careful. Hi, Minnie. Huh? Hi, Polly. How are you? Minnie, you look sad about something. Uh, actually, I am. I'm sad about two things. Two different things? Yes. The first one is I don't know what to get Grandpa for a present, and his birthday is tomorrow. And the other thing is that he can't see that well anymore. Well, I guess that explains why you look so sad. Yup. Hmm. Ah, here's an idea. You could get him a pair of reading glasses. But I've never heard of them. What do they do? They make things look bigger than they really are. If you could do that, then it would take care of both of the things that are upsetting you. I guess, but I'm not even sure where to get reading glasses. Leave it to me. I'm sure we can help you figure that out. All right. So you'd like me to make some reading glasses for Mr. Musty's birthday present? Right, but his birthday is tomorrow. No problem. Hallie will have to wait for his goggles. That's okay, right? No, huh? it's for Mr. Musty's present, so I don't mind. Uh, uh, are you sure? Uh, Thank you so much. Uh, don't mention uh, it. <laughs> <laughs> is it okay if I help you make Grandpa's present, Jen? Oh, so you really want to get involved in making the present too? I think. <laughs> All right, Minnie. Then let's get started. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Minnie, help me move this over there. No, wait. Over here is better. Yes, ma'am. Just tell me what to do and I'll do it. Bye, Grandpa. Minnie? Where are you off to so early? It's a secret. Be back before dark. Huh, rascal. Do 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 do. Huh? It's Minnie. Minnie, what's up? I'm meeting Jen. Oh yeah. Don't forget my grandpa's birthday party tonight. Don't be late. See you later. Why is she in such a hurry? <laughs> Jen. We came to watch. Shh. Jin and I are working very diligently. Hush. Oh. Hush. <laughs> <laughs> All done. So, what do you think of them? Wow. wow. They, they look, look amazing. amazing. <laughs> you did a great job. <laughs> Here you are. <laughs> this was a great idea. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a new pair of glasses. Hmm. 
I wonder why Minnie isn't here. She, she will, will be soon. soon. Hmm. Huh? <laughs> here she is now. Minnie! Uh, huh? Happy birthday, Gramps. Oh, thank you, Rhody. Say, were you hanging out with Minnie at all during the day? No, sir. Minnie was going to the rescue station today. Oh, she was? I bet Mr. Musty has opened up his new glasses by now. <laughs> <laughs> I bet he was really happy with them, Jen. <laughs> Good work. Well, thank you. Luckily, Helly wasn't in a big hurry for his goggles. Oh, <laughs> I'll get to those tomorrow for sure, Helly. Huh? Huh? Oh, Mr. Musty! Happy birthday to you! Oh, thanks, Jin. Tell me, is Minnie there by any chance? She left here a few hours ago. Really? Well, then she should have been home by now. So you're saying oh. Minnie hasn't come home yet? I know. What if something horrible's happened to my granddaughter? Don't worry, Mr. Musty. We'll go search for Minnie. <laughs> Let's split up and look for her. All, All right. right. Okay, then we'll just have to broaden our search. Hey, guys, I found her. Huh? We're at the 16th Street Hill. All right, speed up. Right. right. Are you all right? Get me out! <laughs> Somehow she got stuck between the rocks. She won't budge. Roy, we have some rocks to move. Right. <laughs> Ready? Ready. All right, on the count of three. One, two, three! <laughs> wow, you did it! <laughs> Thank you so much! <laughs> Just glad it all worked out. <laughs> oh my gosh, the presents! <gasps> oh no, they're broken. Grandpa's special presents. <laughs> Minnie. <laughs> oh. oh, it's her. I'm back, Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just happy that you're home safe now. But something bad happened. Your birthday present got broken. Oh. You should know. Minnie and Jin worked hard on it. Oh. I wanted to give you the glasses for your birthday so you could see better. Minnie, do you know what the best present in the whole world for me is? What is it? You, my dear. I'm just happy you came home safely tonight. You are? 
Yes, of course. What would I do without that sweet smile? <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Our, Our pleasure. pleasure. All right. Now that Minnie's back, it's time for the party. Yay! It's party time! <laughs> Did you guys bring a present for my grandpa's birthday? Uh, no. We just, just came, came for, for the cake. cake. What? How could you not bring a present? Ah. Oh, look out! out. Oh. She's right behind you! Get out of here, you two! <laughs> Lecky, Leffy, Letty. Here you go. Thank you, Leffy. What? I'm Leffy. So you're Letty? No, I am. <laughs> Sorry about that. Terry, why, why haven't, haven't you learned, you learned our, our names by, by now? now? Sorry, guys. I get confused. Well, take care. Hmm. Huh? 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 Mail time! Uh. Hello. Huh? Hello, Leffy. Uh -huh. You really can't tell us apart? Well, don't get so upset. You all look exactly the same, and it's hard to tell you apart. And I'm busy now. He, he thinks, thinks we, we all look, look the same. same. No, no, we, we don't. don't. Hey, guys. Huh? Huh? Hurry! What's up? How is everything at the port? Helly, do you know our names? Why are you asking me about that? Because Terry and Posty were just here. They got us mixed up. Helly, you can tell us apart, right? Uh, I know all your names. It's just that, um, you were Lefty? I guess not. I get really confused. You guys just kind of all look the same. Why does everyone keep saying that? We don't look alike. Mm. I'm sorry. I'll try harder next time. <laughs> oh, what have I done? The crane triplets are upset again? What was it about this time? It was bad. I guess everyone's been calling them by the wrong names today. And then I came along and did the same thing. Oh, maybe they're upset because Helly has the best memory in the village. And even he messed them up. Mm-hmm. Because they're triplets, and I always get confused around them. How do you guys keep them straight? Hmm. Well, Lecky is yellow. And Leffy is orange. That leaves Letty the blue crane. Wow, but how do you actually remember all of that? They might look the same, but they're actually quite different. They have their own personalities. And they each have their own quirks. Right. Once you know each of them separately, you won't be confused. Yeah? Hmm. I know they're different colors, but I still can't figure out which one's which. So the blue one's... It's so heavy. Here, let me try. And that one, I think he's Leffy. Huh? Leffy's the strong one. How many of these have we loaded so far? I did two, and Lucky did three, four, no, he did five. It's ten in all. Wow, Letty's really good at math. Huh? You can't count to ten? Oh, come off it. You can't even lift a pillow. Come on, Cece's still waiting for us. We have to get this all loaded up so we don't make her late for her shipment. Hmm, Lecky seems to be really responsible. Lecky, Leffy, Letty, you all look like you're upset about something. Did something happen? Here's what. It's all our friends. Mm -hmm. Nobody's able to tell us apart. We're just so tired of it. That's, that's right. right. We, we just, just don't, don't appreciate, appreciate it. it. Oh, that's awful. Mm -hmm. Oh, it sounds like they're still really mad. Hmm. You guys were right. It turns out that the triplets aren't the same <laughs> at all. <laughs> so how are they different? Leffy's the strong one, Letty's super smart, and Lecky's extremely responsible. All right, then. Now you'll know how to tell the three apart. <laughs> <laughs> I know them all now. I won't mix them up next time. <laughs> <laughs>
Here's an idea. Uh -huh. We can make up a song to help us tell each of them apart. A song? Yes, a song. We can use the lyrics to help us remember each of their differences. And if we teach the song oh. to everyone in Broomstown, then no one will forget which crane is which again. <laughs> well, then maybe Lecky, Leffy, and Letty won't be as angry anymore. <laughs> what do you think? That's, That's a, a really great, great idea. idea. Oh, yeah? Then let's get started right away. Amber, you'll help me? Of course I will. <laughs> what? You're still confused? Well, kind of. We're not going to lift a thing until you can tell us all apart. <clears throat> but you just look so much alike, it's really hard to tell. We look nothing alike. Not even close. Yeah, nothing alike. Stop copying me. That's why our friends oh. keep saying they can't tell mm -hmm. us apart. We're agreeing. Mm -hmm. And Please you're don't just fight. saying things first. Come on. I know that. Stop mm. copying. You stop copying me. <laughs> you guys look exactly the same right now. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, just let go. You let go. <laughs> oh, huh? Oh. Oh. Uh huh? <laughs> That's funny, is it? <laughs> it's time to let go. Yeah, Come let on, go first, stop let it. Go. Someone will get hurt. Get it off. Never. Uh, this must end. No. Uh, this won't end well at all. I can't watch. We know three brothers who work at the port. Aren't Leffy's oh. the strong one? Blue Letty's quite smart. And that leaves Yellow Lecky, who follows his heart. They're three different people who'll never be apart. Oh. How's that? Oh, that was great. You did a really nice job. <laughs> <laughs> It'll help me keep them straight. And now all of Broomstone can learn to tell them apart. Huh? Hi, this is Jin speaking. Oh, Terry. Jin, I need help. What is it, Terry? The cranes are having an argument. Please, they might get hurt. I don't know what to do. Don't worry, Terry. The rescue team is on its way. <laughs> They better get here soon. Why can't they get along? This is going to be tough, but we'll get them you to stop. stop. Good luck, you guys. Uh, huh? Huh? Knock it off, you two! Uh, Lecky, uh, Leffy, Letty, please stop! Yes, please calm down and look at us! Guys, I don't think they can hear us! Stop! You two please, are scratching stop my head! fighting! You won't stop! Oh, oh, come on! Watch out! Are you all right? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Listen, we need you to stop. No, if they it's don't stop, they're going to get hurt. It's no use. They're just too upset to listen to us. I don't think they'll stop until we can somehow calm their anger. What can we do to calm them down? Hmm. Oh, I know. 
We know three brothers who work down at the port. You may think they're similar, but take a closer look. Yes, we know three brothers who work at the port. Orange Lefty's huh? the strong one, Blue Letty's quite smart, and that leaves it's Purple Letty who follows his heart. They the stopped so they could hear the song. Never be huh. apart. We should all sing it. The, the brothers are cream triplets who live down at the port. Oh. You may think that they're similar, but take another look. Orange Lefty's the strong one, his muscles oh. are of steel. Blue Letty's quite intelligent, he learned so much at school. And that leaves Yellow Lecky, who listens to his heart. Guess they're three different people who'll never be apart. <laughs> Lecky, Leffy, Letty. I'm sorry that I never took the time to properly learn all your names. I'm sure that it must have been very frustrating for each one of you. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, too. Oh, thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. And we really love the song. It made me forget that I was mad. Mm -hmm. I'm glad. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. But please, stop fighting. You're brothers. You should be getting along better than anyone. We know. <laughs> uh, Terry, I'm sorry we made you late. I'll get these drain pipes all cleaned up. Oh, no. I'll clean them up. No way. Mm. I'll get them. No, you will not. I said Here they go. I'll do it. They just I don't said stop. I <laughs> Let's play together, Poke. It's nice out today. Right, Poke? Uh -huh. <laughs> huh? A butterfly? No, Cleanie. My turn. I want to guess. What's oh. up? Let's go see, oh. Poke. Oh. <laughs> well, I almost got it. <laughs> hey, friends. Hey, Max. Oh. Is something fun going on? We huh? were all playing a riddle game. Whoa, that sounds fun. Oh. Can we play along? Poke, huh? sounds fun, right? Oh. Oh. <laughs> sure, <laughs> we'll all play. <laughs> Here's the question. What animal has a long nose and big ears? A bunny. Huh? <laughs> You're wrong, Max. Uh -huh. An elephant. Hey, guys. Hi, Hi Ellie. Ellie. So what's going on? Oh. Uh, Poke, where are you going? Wow, what's wrong with him? We were playing riddles, and Poke tried to answer the question. But I just couldn't understand what he was saying. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That is too bad. I guess if you guys weren't going to be able to understand him, then he figured he couldn't play the game with you guys after all. No, oh, it's my fault. I made him play. I should go and talk to him. Poke, hey! Poke! Oh. And so, are you saying Poke just drove away when he realized he couldn't play the game with his friends? Yes. Poke must feel just terrible now. Uh, All he wanted was to play with them. Uh -huh. I wonder, is there any way for people to understand what Poke is saying? Who knows? That is a really hard problem to solve. Uh. Huh? Wait! I can solve this! What is it you're thinking, Jin? You'll just have to wait. Trust me, I can promise it's a great idea. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Is Poke around? I haven't seen him. I thought he was with you. Well, he was, but we stopped to play this game of riddles with some friends. So you're saying huh? that Poke just drove away? Yes, I did try going after him, but I wasn't able to find him anywhere at all. Don't worry. Both of us are going to help you look for him. Oh. Hmm. Uh-huh. Ta-da! <laughs> what, what is, is that? that? A brainwave pencil. This machine draws what you're thinking about. If he wears this, Poke's friends will all understand what he's trying to tell them. Like so. Is that a finger? No, it's a bird. I don't know what that is. It's totally a rabbit. Rabbit? Jin, the pencil draws like you, and even you have to admit that you can't draw. What? <laughs> <laughs> Not every invention works right the first time. I'll make it work. Well, we'll see. If this really does end up helping Poke, that would be great. Hey, Poke! 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 Hey, Poke! Are you here? Oh. Hey, guys! Look at those tracks. Poke came this way. Poke! Let's follow. Oh. Oh. Hey, Poke! Oh. Hey, Poke! Huh? The tracks end at that rock slide. Well, what if Poke is trapped underneath those rocks? What? what? Hmm. Uh. Uh. Poke! Uh. Guys! Hook's in there! No, no way! Hook! We're here! Are you okay? Look at him. I don't think he wants to get out of that cave. I'm going to move these rocks. It's on! Watch it, Bruder! That was so close! I don't think we can do this by ourselves. Let's call the rescue team. It's supposed to be an airplane. It's even worse than it was before. What's wrong with you, Brainwave Pencil? Hmm? Rescue team, this is Jin. Oh, well, hello there, Dump. Jin, we need help. Poke is in terrible trouble. What? Exactly what is happening? Emergency! Emergency! Poke is trapped in a cave in Broom's forest. Answering. They're here. Hey, hey friends. Holy, Poke is trapped inside this cave. Don't you worry. We're going to get him out of there. Could you all please move to a safe distance? Okay, okay sure. sure. Let's hurry up and clear away all these rocks. All, all right. Holy. Hmm, good job. Yes. Poke. Huh? Are you hurt? 
Oh, oh. Poke. Oh. Oh. Polly, let me try to talk to him. Oh. Poke, oh. are you all right? Uh -huh. That's good. But Poke, it's dangerous here. We should go. Uh -uh. You want to stay here? Uh -huh. I know you're sad now, but Poke, listen. Your friends are really worried about you. Look there. Poke! We were really worried about you. Come on out. Let's all play together. Yeah, Poke. We like having you around. It doesn't matter that you don't say very much. Huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that you're smiling. Do you want to go see your friends now? Yes, Poke. Let's get out of this cave. <laughs> <laughs> I'll inspect the cave before I leave. You go ahead. All right. Let's go, Poke. <laughs> <laughs> Poke! <laughs> We're glad you're safe. I was really worried about you. Huh? Oh, wow, what a beautiful little elephant. <laughs> hey, friends. Huh? Huh? Just look at what Poke made. Wow! wow. That's, That's just awesome. Poke, awesome. you've got a real talent. Oh. <laughs> and now, guys, Poke will give the question. Poke will ask the question. Uh huh. Um. Uh, <laughs> hey, hey, airplane! <laughs> <laughs> I guess we don't need Jin's brain pencil after all. Right. Poke found his own completely unique way to talk to his friends. Yes, we can all understand Poke just a little bit better now. <laughs> Poke, you know us. We love you, Poke. <laughs> Thank you, Cleanie. Cleaning with my rolling mop, cleaning every speck and drop. Oh, yeah! Oh, come back! Oh, my rolling mop! Oh, 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 oh. oh my rolling mop! Please! Oh, oh. Cleanie? What are you doing out here? Well, my rolling mop fell off and rolled in there. And I can't reach it. Looks like I'm going to have to call the rescue team. Oh. What? I don't think you need the rescue team. Look out. Hmm? Hmm. Hmm. See? It's no problem. Wow! Titan! Thanks! Sure. All right. Back to work. Cleanie! Hmm? Holy! Hello! Hello there, Cleanie. I noticed you look really happy. Did something good happen today? Huh? <gasps> yes! My rolling mop got stuck between two big wooden piles. I tried and tried to pull it out, but I just couldn't do it. <laughs> then Titan came along. He moved the wood and saved my favorite mop. <laughs> and so, if Titan's ever in trouble, I'm going to make sure I'm there to help him out. Well then, Titan is lucky to have a friend like you. <laughs> hmm? <clears throat> there. Let's move out. Hello, Titan. Huh? <laughs> Cleanie. What are you doing back there? Huh? What if I had backed into you? 
Sorry. <laughs> but your tires are a little dirty. I'll clean them up. <laughs> <laughs> Cleany, I don't need my tires cleaned right now. They're so dirty. Are you sure? <laughs> Stop it! Oh, goodness! I'm very busy. Titan! <laughs> huh? oh. Oh. This can go also. All right. Thank you, Helly. Not a problem. Uh -huh. Did you guys finish already? Yes. Now uh. we just have to wait for Cleany to pick mm -hmm. up recycling. Here he comes, right on time. Welcome, Welcome Cleany. Hello. Is this all your recycling? Yes. It's heavy, though. Would you like me to help you with it? Mm -hmm. No. Cleany, what's gone wrong? You were so happy earlier. Holy! It looks like I can't do anything to help Titan. Cleany, what do you mean? Well, actually, I tried. I found him at the wood pile. So, so that's, that's what happened. happened. Oh, yes. The only thing I wanted to do was help him, but I think what I actually did was make him annoyed. Oh, what if he doesn't like me? It's not that. He must have had something going on. That's right. Titan is usually awfully busy. Hmm? You see there, Cleany? He only turned down your help because he was so busy. You mean it? Yes, Cleany. Yes, when you try to help him again, I'm sure it will go better. I know it will. Oh, thank you, friends. <laughs> there. Time to get moving. Cleany? <laughs> well, you're here again. Where are you going? To the lumber yard. Can I help you with anything? I'm fine, thanks. I could do a little more work on those dirty tires. <sighs> All right, Cleany. What is it you expect of me? Well, I. Well, I just wanted to help you, that's all. You want to help me, do you? <laughs> that is pretty funny. Please move. I'm busy. All right. Uh. Oh. Huh? What's that? Oh my gosh! Titan! Titan! Yikes! What if he gets into an accident? Oh! Help! Oh no! <laughs> Team. Ah. Rescue team, this is Jin. Hello, Cleany. Jin, please help. Titan's in trouble. You have to help him. What? Tell me what's happening. Emergency! Emergency! Titan's on his way to the lumber mill, and he doesn't know his tires are broken. You have to find him before it's too late. Team, move out. All, All right. right. and see if you can locate Titan. Okay. <laughs> hey guys, I found Titan. He's driving down Windmill Hill. He's fine so far. Good work. Have him pull over. Say we need to check his tires. All right. Titan. Titan. <gasps> What do you want, Ellie? There might be a problem with your tires. What? My tires? I don't know what you're talking about. My tires are fine. You need to stop, just in case. We have to take a look at all your tires now. Ellie, I'm very busy. Titan! Oh. Huh? Oh! 
Titan, we're coming! Roy, now! Okay! Amber! Airbag! Okay! I'm saved! I think that I'm fine. <laughs> Thank you very much. No, no problem. problem. One thing, how did you know that I was going to have an accident? Well, a good friend of yours told us that there was something wrong with your tires. What? Who told you that? Someone very interested in helping you. Who's interested in helping me? Titan! Huh? <sighs> Cleanie? Here you are, once again. Titan, you're all right. I was worried I reported it too late. It was you. You alerted the rescue team. Because of your report, I'm still in one piece. Thank you for your help. Oh heck. You saved my rolling mop. You have no idea what that means to me. <laughs> Cleany, I'm sorry. I was rude earlier. I don't deserve your kindness. It's okay. <laughs> By the way, Titan, can I ask you a favor? Of course. Can I pretty please clean your tires for you? They're really dirty. Yes, you can. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Careful there, Cleany. That tickles a bit. <laughs> okay, <laughs> it really, really tickles. I'm sorry. I'll do it slower. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh, that tickles. <laughs> that tickles even more like that. <laughs> and a swarm of bees. La 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 la, it's a holiday. What should I do? Huh? It's Polly and School Bee. Also, look out for bees. Don't ever leave sweet food just sitting around. And if you do see a beehive, remember to never touch it. Okay, Polly. Also, bees like the color yellow, so School Bee needs to be extra careful. Well, have a good field trip. <laughs> Thank you, Polly. <laughs> okay, kids, get on board. All right. <laughs> oh, we're going on a picnic. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Polly. Hello there, Spooky. What are you doing? The kids are going on a picnic today. So I just stopped by to go over some safety rules. Picnic? Wow, that sounds like big fun. <laughs> Polly, wanna go? <laughs> that does sound like fun. 
but I have to work today. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> Bye, Spooky. I need to go. Oh. oh, by the way, a swarm of bees has been spotted nearby. Please be careful. Goodbye. Bye, Bully. Hmm, I want to go to the picnic. No, why shouldn't I? I'm going to the picnic. <laughs> picnic! <laughs> Gosh, it has to come down. Hmm. All right. Shelly, no! Grabbing at a bee's nest is something you should never do. Huh? Uh, are you sure? Just come down and go back inside. Let me take care of the nest. All right. Thanks, Helly. It's fine. <laughs> Bruner! Hello there, Spooky. What brings you here? <laughs> Bruner, want to have a picnic? Picnic? No, not today. As you can see, I'm very busy. You don't know what you're missing. It's going to be amazing. Don't work too hard. Catch you later. Goodbye. Why are you flying away? I'm just trying to move you to a better home. Helly, huh? think you need my help? I'm fine, Roy. I've almost got it. Hey, friends. Holy! Oh. What's up? Some bees built their nest up there. Helly's trying to move it. There have been reports of increased numbers of bees all around town recently. I guess the station's no exception. All ah. done. Good, Good job, job Helly. So, did you safely remove the nest? Yes, but a few bees flew away. Hey, guys. Huh? Huh? Uh, are you already finished? Huh? <laughs> Can away! What? what? Uh, no! Go away! <laughs> oh no, my nose! You okay, okay Jin? Oh no, I think she got stung. Uh huh? Why did those bees attack me all of a sudden like that? It's because of your drink, you know. Bees are attracted to sugary things. We should take care of that and take the stinger out. Mm. Okay. Driving down the street, looking mighty sweet. Oh, yeah. Huh? Hey, bees. You want to go to a picnic today? You'll see. If you come with me, you'll have so much fun. <laughs> Wait up. Hang on. Hey. <laughs> What are you doing? Come on! What about our picnic? Let's go for a picnic together! Come out! <laughs> What's that sweet smell? Swarm of bees? 
The giant swarms right behind him, and they're headed for the town square. Don't worry. The rescue team is on its way. <laughs> I think we'd better lure Spooky and the Swarm away from town. Right. Helly, find Spooky and see if you can lead him toward 14th Street. Hmm. All right. Roy, Amber, shortcut time. Okay. okay. guys almost there okay roy prepare a smoke screen when heli arrives set it off all right spooky hang on not far to go Hey, Spooky, it's very dangerous to mess with bees' nests. I was only just messing around. I had no idea what the bees would do. Spooky, from now on, you have got to leave bees' nests alone. If somebody messed with your house, you'd be upset, right? Well, bees feel the same. Also, when bees come after you, you should try to stay still. If you start moving around all over the place, the bees may think that you're attacking them. <laughs> I'll try to remember all that. It's nice to have a good time, but safety must come first. Okie dokie. I'll be more careful. Huh? Wait, hold on. Where are you going? <laughs> Spooky! Huh? Oh, <laughs> sorry. I forgot. <laughs> Huh? 
I like myself. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. The Big Broomstown Athletic Competition is tomorrow. Mm-hmm. You all know what you're supposed to do to get ready, right? We, we do, do, Jin. I will prepare <laughs> first aid supplies just to be safe. Roy and I will be constructing the stadium. Mm-hmm. I'll check the safety equipment. Good. Sounds like you all know what you're doing, right? Hey, Jin, have a lot of people signed up? Of course. And registration continues through the end of today. So I expect a lot more people will be signing up. Hey, maybe we should remind everybody about the deadline to compete so they can sign up if they forgot. All right. Hello, Broomstown friends. Remember the first Broomstown Athletic Competition is tomorrow. If you haven't registered to compete yet, please do so by this afternoon. Did Jin say registration's almost done? Haven't you registered yet? We already signed up. You did? I guess I better hurry up. Mr. Builder, may I please go register for the competition? Why, sure, if you hurry back. Thanks. Bye-bye. <laughs> Long jump and Pep will be racing. <laughs> okay, Roy. Good work. Just a bit more to be done. Okay. Tomorrow will be great, right? Hey, fellas! Huh? Hello! Hello, Max! Did you come to register? Yes. What events are you guys going to be in? Well, I'll be racing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> wow! Cap, you're so fast! Well, that's very <laughs> true. I'm going to be in the long jump. <laughs> Whoa! You fellas are really great. <laughs> See you later. Goodbye. Bye. Jin. Hey, Max. Hello there. Have you come to register? Yes, but I'm not exactly sure which event. Well, come take a look at this. Thanks. Racing, long jump, high jump, and hurdles? Oh, those events are all really hard. All right. Have you made a decision? No. No. I'll have to think about it and come back. Remember, get back before dark, okay? Mm. Oh. What event should I pick? Maybe I could be in the race. Yeah! <laughs> Maybe not the race, but how about long jumping? Oh, okay, maybe not the long jump. Maybe I shouldn't compete at all. Oh. Did he even get off the ground? <laughs> 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 oh, I'd make a fool out of myself. Huh? Max, so did you get registered? No. Whoa, you look sad. That's not the way to the construction site. Where's Max going? Good. Pack that down and it's done. Hey, I thought Max would have been back by now. You're right. Didn't he say he was coming right back? What if he got in some kind of an accident? Oh. Let's hope not. But where could he be? Hmm. Well, looks like we're almost ready. Holy, huh? the first aid tent is ready to go. All of the safety equipment totally checks out. And registration is now closed. Good work, guys. 
<laughs> as soon as Roy finishes inspecting the track, we'll be ready for tomorrow's competition. Hey, guys! Uh -huh. We have a problem. Oh, there are cracks in the track. This is serious. Holy, we should repair the track immediately. Hmm. We need to repave the track with new asphalt. Know what? We should go ask Max to help us out with this. When it comes to asphalt, he is the greatest. Okay, I'll go call Mr. Builder. Huh? Rescue team, this is Jen. Uh, Mr. Builder. What, Max? Yes, he was here a while ago. What? Don't you worry. Of course we'll look for him. What's, What's up, up, Jen? It's Max. He never made it back to work after coming here to sign up for the competition. <gasps> oh. oh, yeah. He said he was going to come back, but he didn't. What? What if he's gotten into some kind of trouble? Oh, my gosh. We need to be out there looking for him right now. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> We should split up and look for Max. Okay. okay! Max! Max! Cap, huh? have you seen Max? Max, huh? He was signing up for the competition, but that was a while ago. Thank you. Take care now. Huh? Oh, Max, I saw him. Huh? But it looked to me like something was wrong. He looked really sad and then just drove off towards 7th Street. He went towards 7th? Rescue team, Spooky saw Max headed to 7th Street. What? Please head to 7th Street. Roger! Roger. Holy. Holy! Let's hurry up. See if Max is anywhere in the area. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Max! 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 Are you here? Oh, there he is. I see him on the Eastern Hill. I found him! <gasps> Max! Huh? Huh? Max! Max! <laughs> what are you doing here? Why are you out here all alone? Is something wrong? Yeah, Max. You never came back to register. Well, actually, I couldn't register for the competition. You say that you couldn't register? But why not? I'm so heavy and slow. If I tried to race, everybody would laugh at me. That's not true. Your friends would never think like that. They like the way that you are. I don't. I really wanted to be part of the competition, but I know that I can't. And I'm too embarrassed to tell my friends. Oh. Oh, hey, why don't you join our preparation committee? Preparation committee? Yes. You don't have to compete to participate. You can help us prepare, and you can help things run smoothly. He's right. Without good people working behind the scenes, there couldn't be any competition at all. Come on, Max. Say that you'll join our competition preparation team. Okay? Really? Can I? Of, of course, course, Max. Max. <laughs> <laughs> Max, listen. There's something we need your help with right away. How can I help? <sighs> All done. <laughs> Would you please, Max? All right. <sighs> <sighs> oh, 
Wow. wow! That looks awesome! And now we're ready for the competition, thanks to you. Thank, Thank you, Max. Max. I'm just glad that I could help. Well, can you help tomorrow? Sure, I'd be happy to. Can you fix the sand pit? You got it. <sighs> Thank you, Max. You're welcome. <laughs> hey, guys, look at Max there. Yeah, he's really awesome. Max, Whoa. you're the man. <laughs> I'm heavy and I'm slow, and I like myself that way. <laughs> Annie's trip. Hey, everybody. I went to the port with my mom and dad this weekend and saw Cece carrying a suitcase. It was huge. Yeah? I went to an amusement park. You did? Well, listen huh? to this. Ta-da! Cool, huh? Wow! I went to the toy store at the mall with my dad. Oh. Annie, huh? did you have fun? Me? Fun? Scooby! Good morning, everyone. Now, be sure to watch your step. Uh, uh, uh. Huh? Annie, come on. Is something wrong? You don't need to know what's wrong. Hmm. Okay, let's go! Hmm. <sighs> Amber, mind if I put this by you? Great. Thanks, Polly. You're welcome. <laughs> Right, I think we're finally ready. Amber! Huh? Good, Good morning. morning! Good morning! Wow! Planting flowers? Mm-hmm. I'm about to start making a new garden. Amber? I'd love it if you'd let me put these in the ground. Really? You want to plant them? Yeah. I want to. I just came up with a great idea. Then how about we all help out? Oh, no. I should do this all by myself. As long as you show me how, I'll be the best planter. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Jin. Are you ready? <laughs> of course I am. Great, Jin. First thing to do is dig some holes to plant the flowers in. Right. It's hole digging time. Thanks, Scooby. Goodbye, everyone. <laughs> Hmm? Annie, aren't you going home? I'm not. I don't want to go home. My mom and dad aren't there. What about Grandma Lisa? Grandma Lisa never wants to play with me, and Mom and Dad are always huh? busy. I want to see the town the way my friends and their parents do. If my other friends can do that, then I can do that too. Oh, okay. Annie, why don't you come and visit Owl Valley with me today? Will it be fun? Sure. It's a great place to do some sightseeing. Really? I want to go. <laughs> so, two o'clock in front of your house. See you then. Yay. Mm -hmm. I'm finished. Yay. <laughs> How's that? You did a great job. The size and location of the holes are perfect. The next step is to plant the flowers. You don't want to injure the roots, so gently put them in the holes and cover them with soil. Think you can do that? Sure, but what I'm going to be working on starting now is a secret, so until I'm done, remember no peeking allowed. <laughs> All right. Can't wait, Jin. <gasps> Scooby! You're early, Annie, so come on in. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go! We're off to Owl Valley! Yay! <laughs> We're here, Annie! Watch your step! <gasps> I knew you'd like it. 
Only a few of my friends have been here before. Oh. Yeah, it's beautiful. <laughs> Just wait until everybody sees this. Attention, everybody! Please come to the flower garden. Oh, wow! <laughs> that's the rescue team symbol. So that's why you wanted to do this alone. You didn't do this all by yourself, did you? You're amazing! Oh. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. Now we have a rescue team flower garden of our own. Jin, don't you think we should take a picture? That's a great idea, Helly. <laughs> First, I start the timer. Hurry, Hurry Helly! Helly. Ooh. Jeez! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Annie, isn't it beautiful out here? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Pretty flowers. Did your mom make your hat? Yup. The flower on it's one of her favorites. She put one here and one here, too. That's nice that your mom made those for you. You know... That just goes to show how much your mother loves you. Oh, no. I think my mom and dad are tired of me. Tired? How can that be? If not, then they just don't like me. They're never at home. I'm always alone. Annie, both of your parents aren't home because they have jobs and work really hard. It's not because they don't like you. They work hard because they love you a lot. They want to take care of you. Hey, those flowers. Your mom made your things because she cares so much about you. Huh? Hmm. Try to remember other times when they've tried to show you how much they care. Well, I guess when I'm asleep, Daddy gives me a kiss, but his whiskers tickle my cheek. <laughs> what else? I remember one time when I was really sick. My mom stayed up all night and took care of me. You see? They do love you. You're lucky to have them. Yeah, guess you're right. <laughs> <gasps> Look, that's the flower my mom likes. Where? Hey, wait here. Uh, uh, come back, Annie. It's dangerous. It's okay. I'm just getting this flower. Annie, you could get hurt. I'll be right back. Uh, got it. Uh -huh. can see is your back. <laughs> Oops, sorry. <laughs> huh? Huh? Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin, you've got to help. I'm at Owl Valley with Annie and she fell down a hill. What? Don't worry, Scooby. I'll send the rescue team right away. <laughs> Let us know what we have to do. Okay. There they are. Annie. Hallie. You okay? Uh-huh. Just relax. The rescue team's coming. They're here. Don't worry, Scooby. We'll get Annie back up here safe and sound. Amber, we need the rescue basket. And Roy, please prepare the crane. All, All right. right. All set, Polly. Good. Roy, lower the rescue basket slowly. Will do. Huh? Uh, 
Now, carefully get inside. Uh, it's safe. Don't be afraid. He's, He's right, right, Annie. Annie. Just, Just go, go slowly. slowly. Good job, Annie! Good, Good job, job, Annie! Annie. Mm. Oh, she's safe now. We're, We're glad, glad you're okay. okay! But, Annie, it was really dangerous to pick those flowers by going so near the cliff's edge. He's right. If something happened and you had gotten hurt, your parents would have been really sad. Yeah, I'll never do it again. Where did my flower go? Your flower's right here. Oh, thank you. I know what I did was wrong, but I still wanted to give it to my mom. I see. I'm sure your Lily of the Valley will be happy to go back home with you. It's great that the root's still alive, so when you get home, you can replant it. That's what it's called? Ooh. Lily of the Valley? That's a pretty name. It's a pretty flower, too. It looks like little ringing bells. <laughs> Helly's <laughs> right. But now it's time for you to get back home. Oh. I'm sure your parents are worried about you by now. <laughs> Thank you. You're all so nice. You're, You're welcome, welcome Annie. Huh? It's Mom and Dad. I'll see you all later. <laughs> Mommy! Daddy! It's late. We were worried. <laughs> Look at this! Oh! I'm so glad Annie got back home safe and sound. I should have never suggested the trip. Don't worry, School Bee. Even though there was a problem, I'm sure Annie had a great time. Right! right. Gee, I hope you're right. Hey, School Bee? Huh? Oh! School Bee, uh. I had a great time. <laughs> Thanks! Great! I had a lot of fun too, Annie! Now, does our princess want to go into her castle? Yay! <laughs> See? I told Annie her mom and dad love her. A lot. <laughs> Treasure hunt. Cans go here, glasses go here, and papers here. Huh? Oh. What is this? Is this a treasure, a treasure map? map? Huh? Ah, Posty! So, are you going to look for it? What? The treasure! After all, you've got a treasure map! Well, how do I know if it's a real treasure map or a phony one? Of course it's real! Then, what do I do? That's easy! We find it! And by that, I mean you and I! Posty? Uh, huh? Hmm. You're late, you know. I had some things to get done first. Oh. Okay. So where are we going first? Hmm, let's see. First, we go... Says, past the intersection to the side entrance to Owl Valley. That way. All right. Let's go. Huh? Wait for me, Posty. We should hurry up before the sun Tomorrow, you'll learn all about safety at the Safety Education Camp. You'll learn the right way to put out a fire. And you will also learn how to help your friends in case any of them get injured. And also, don't forget to bring a spare tire tomorrow. Right! Hey, we've got a surprise! A special event waiting for you there! You'll love it! Wow! Tell, Tell us more! more! It's a secret! You'll find out tomorrow! <laughs> if we go this way... There's a key hidden underneath the tree that looks just like a ghost. Where is it? Uh, uh, uh -huh. That's it! <laughs> Slow down! Oh. Hmm. Let's see! Uh. Huh? I found it! Uh. Oh. Only the one who possesses this key can open the treasure chest. Wow! There really is, is a treasure. treasure! Maybe it's a bunch of recycled gold pots and pans. Oh. No way! It's a solid oh. gold mailbox! <laughs> wow! A gold mailbox! <laughs> uh, oh. Leany! <laughs> you know, I think you should give me the key. Why? If you have both the key and the treasure map, you might go 
sounds like you're thinking of taking the treasure all for yourself. No, no way. I don't even know where the treasure is because I don't have the map. Hmm. Okay, Posty. I'll give you the key. That's it. But I'll keep the map. You won't get to see it. Sounds good to me. There. So where to next, Cleanie? Hmm. Uh, hmm? Huh? Follow huh? me. Uh. Kelly! The garage is a complete mess! Sorry, Jin. I'll clean it up in a bit. That's strange. Where did he go? Uh. Huh? Kelly! Oh, we should be there by now. I hope it's the right place. So why huh? don't you take out the map and have a look? Okay. Close your eyes huh? first. Hmm. Whatever you say. Oh. Huh? As you follow the valley road heading straight, pass by a lone tree and then bear to your right. The treasure's at the Elephant Rock. So you lost something for tomorrow's special event? Mm-hmm. It sounds important, but what is it? A treasure map. A, a treasure, treasure map? map? The map for a treasure hunt. I wanted to have it for the end of camp. Wait, Helly. Could it be that grubby old piece of paper that was rolled up and sitting on the garage desk? Right. That's it. Did you see it? I did. But I thought it was trash, so I threw it away. What? But I made it look really old, just like it was a real treasure map. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Sorry, Helly. Huh? Rescue team, this is Jim. Jim, we're in trouble. What's going on? Cleanie's trapped, hanging off a cliff in the Yellow Valley. All right. I'll send the rescue team right away. <laughs> See what's going on. Right. Ellie, I'll be down there soon. Roy, Amber, 
While I go down, get the rescue gear prepared. We'll, we'll do. do. Don't worry. We'll have you out of here soon. Oh, thank you. Roy, lower the basket down. Got it. A little more. Get in carefully. I'm scared. Helly! Oh. Oh. You're fine, Cleanie. You can do it. Just go slow. Good job, Cleanie. Oh, that could have been a disaster. Roy, pull it up slowly. Okay. What? You were out looking for the treasure. With this map? Huh? Hey, that's my treasure map. Yeah, I made it for our special event. I was going to use it for a surprise treasure hunt for the kids at safety education camp. It's not real? What about Aww. my gold mailbox? Aww. I guess there is no such thing. My gold recycle Aww. pots and pans. Don't be so sad. There really is a treasure. <laughs> <Really>? <laughs> Full of lots of pictures of our town. <laughs> wow! Awesome! Yeah! This is the talent contest, and this is the athletic competition. And guess who this is? It's, it's us! us. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this really is a treasure! Sure is. And doesn't that mean our village is really a precious treasure? Yep. Amber, you're so smart. Having a village photo album is a great idea, don't you think? Best treasure <laughs> I've ever seen. <laughs> we didn't know what it was for, and then we got really greedy. I'm so embarrassed. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys, this still has to be kept top secret. We have three new students to surprise. All right. We, we can, can keep, keep a secret. secret. Whew, what a relief. We've got our map back. Let the hunt begin. <laughs> A friend under the sea. Hmm. Aw. Hmm. Isn't this bolt the right size? Good, Good morning. morning. Huh? Morning. Hey, what are you working so hard on? Uh, <laughs> a periscope. It's for exploring. Wow. wow. That looks pretty amazing. Thanks, guys. But I'm stuck. I need lots of parts that the rescue center doesn't have. The parts I have are no good. Oh, oh don't worry. I'll try to look around for you and find parts that'll help. Really? Thanks, Helly. Hold on. Why isn't Roy here? He's at the port checking the fire extinguishers. And on the way, he's going to meet up with his friend, Marine. <laughs> Ming Ming, stop it! I already know you're there, so come on out. Marine! Huh? Ming! Ming! Roy! Did you have a safe trip to port? Perfect. You came at a good time. I'd like to introduce you to a friend of mine. Of yours? Where? Ming Ming, say hi. This is my friend, Roy. Ming! Wow, a dolphin! Ming Ming, Ming it's fine. <laughs> you could come out. Maybe she just doesn't like me. No, Ming Ming's just shy. If you get to know her better, she might even sing for you. 
Sing a song for me? I'd love that. Say, would you mind if I introduced Ming Ming to the rescue team? Go ahead. <laughs> wow, so cute! Hello, I'm Amber. <laughs> and I'm Polly. I'm Jin. And I'm Helly. Ming! What? She's hiding. Remember? Roy said Ming Ming is really shy. But once she knows you better, she'll sing for you. Really? <laughs> Ming Ming, let's be <laughs> friends. Ming! Whoa, cold. Sorry, Ming Ming. I didn't mean to upset or annoy you. Huh? <gasps> Ah, Jen, huh? I'm not sure if you can use these, but here, I found this and that. Wow! Helly, thank you so much. I'll be able to use all of it. Uh, glad to hear it. Hey, friends. Huh? Holy! What are you guys doing here so late into the night? Working hard. The periscope's almost <laughs> finished. That's because Helly brought me some really useful parts. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> there isn't a part anywhere that <laughs> Helly can't find. That's, That's right. right. Helly, when it's all finished, you'll be the first to use it. Yahoo! And then I'll be able to see Ming Ming using that periscope. Uh, Ming Ming? Yeah. Ming Ming keeps squirting me with water so I can't get close to her. <sighs> Maybe Ming Ming just doesn't like me. I don't think that's true. The reason why she keeps squirting water is because that's how Ming Ming breathes. <laughs> that's right. See, dolphins are different from fish because they need air to breathe like you. But when she breathes, water comes out at the same time. Well, I guess that makes sense. But is there an easy way to get to know her better? Just don't give up. Go and see her often. Right, Helly. Huh. It just takes time. Hmm. Oh, I can't wait for Ming Ming to sing me a song. Ah. <sighs> <sighs> I slept well. Ming Ming, how did you sleep? Huh? Oh, Ming Ming. Ming Ming. Ming Ming, what's wrong? Ming. Are you feeling sick? Ming Ming. I finally finished my periscope. Wow, that's, that's really awesome. awesome. Helly, huh? why don't you give it a try? I can? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> wow, mm. I can see. <laughs> now. <laughs> wow, I can move it up or down and see anything I want. <laughs> You're the best, Jin. Why, thanks. Huh? Uh. Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin, I need help. Maureen, what's wrong? Ming Ming, she's acting real sick. What? what? That sounds just uh -huh. awful. Right. She needs to get to a hospital right away. Please, can you help me get her there? Sure, Maureen. I'm sending the rescue team. Ming Ming, cheer up. The rescue team's coming. Ming Ming! Huh? Ming Ming! Ming Ming! Huh? Help 
like me. Ming Ming sunk under the water. She's so weak. What? I looked around and can't locate her. We have to find her now before something awful happens. Don't worry, Marine. We're going to save Ming Ming. Holy! Let's use the periscope. This will be the perfect tool to show us exactly where Ming Ming is. Perfect. Please go and get the periscope now. Right. And we should get ready for the rescue until Heli gets back. Got, Got it. Ready, Roy. Right. Got it. Helly. I found her. Ming Ming's lying at the bottom. Right. I want you to mark her location. Got Tank. All right. That's it. Right there. Perfect. Oh, no. Ming Ming doesn't want to go inside the rescue tank. What? what? She's probably scared. What if Ming Ming won't come off the bottom? Ming Ming, don't be afraid. We're trying to help you. Right, Ming Ming. You can trust us. Please go inside. Ming Ming, please go. Ming Ming? Ming, Ming for us? Ming Ming. Don't worry, we'll get her safely to the hospital. Thank you all. Roy, take good care of Ming Ming. Don't worry. Okay, let's get going. Right! right. <laughs> <laughs> Great! Ming Ming's well again. Ming Ming, we're, we're so, so glad, glad you're safe. safe. Because of your help, you saved her, and now she's back to normal. Throwing a can in the sea? That's awful! You're right. There are a lot of wonderful friends like Ming Ming who live under the sea. When people see this, I don't think we'll ever have a problem like that again. And we'll remind everyone in town to take care of the sea. <laughs> and that is a promise. Thank you all. Ming Ming! Ming Ming, don't ever get sick again. Wow! Mm. Ming Ming's singing you a song. Wow! That must mean we're Ming Ming's friends now, doesn't it? Uh. That singing, it sounds a little bit weird if you ask me. I wouldn't call that weird. I'd call that out of tune and awful. Awful? You only have to listen to it this one time, but I have to listen to it every time I come into port. What? <laughs> <laughs> Thinking of Granddaughter. Do I stand on this side? Yep, and look right here. Focused? Yeah, crystal clear. We're, We're back. back! Hey, friends! Helly, I heard the camera was broken. Is it fixed now? Fixed now? Helly was so impatient, it had to be now. <laughs> Guess she's right. I hadn't been able to take pictures in such a long time. Roy, I'll take yours, okay? 
<laughs> Not now. As you can see, I'm in need of a lot of washing. Why don't you take some pictures of some of your friends in town? Yeah, Helly. I'm sure they'd be happy to let you. Wow, that's a good idea. I'll go and take them right now. Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> You're all set, Minnie. Hey. Thanks, Mr. Wheeler. <laughs> Grandpa, would it be all right if I went and saw my friends for a while? Yes, of course. Thank you. See you later. <sighs> you know, I'd really like to see my granddaughter today. I'm sure. How long has it been? Why don't you invite her over sometime? I'd love to do just that, but unfortunately, she lives in an overseas country that's far, far away from here. I can't go there because of the store. Try not to let it bother you. I need to take my leave of you now. Have a good day, my friend. Bye. Take good care. Betty must have grown a lot. Huh? Huh? Hi, Mr. Wheeler. Hello, Posty. What brings you here? A package for you. Huh. <clears throat> All right. See you later. Thanks, Posty. Oh, it's from Betty. Look, there's even a letter. Now, let's see. To my loving grandfather. Grandpa, I miss you so much. Mom said thanks to this computer, I can talk on the telephone with you at the same time as I watch your face. It's called video telephony. I'm very, very glad that I'll be able to see you any time. Incredible. But I've never seen so many buttons before. Huh. How do I get this machine to work? Hi there, Mr. Wheeler. Oh, Helly, what brings you here? I'm taking lots of pictures of all my friends in the town. Do you want me to take a picture of you? A picture? No, not right now. Do you know how to use this? Wow, where'd you get the computer? My granddaughter, Betty. But I have no idea how to use this thing at all. Jin can help you use your computer. She's really good at these things. Really? Hmm. Look, it's working. This button is used to turn the computer on. That's fascinating. <laughs> huh? And then, if you move the arrow with the mouse and click the icon, you can make a video call. Want to give it a try? Mm-hmm. I turn on the computer with this and make a video call by clicking here. That's perfect. Say, do you want to call Betty right now? Should I? That's right. She's sleeping. Since there, it's the middle of the night. I'll call her later. Then let's turn it off. Let me show you how. You point the arrow on the red off icon and click on it. Now you should try it out. All right. I do this, point the arrow on the red icon and click. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> but there's one more thing to remember. This computer is made in a different country, which is why you use this. It's called a voltage converter. Uh-huh, whatever. This is quite amazing. If you have any questions at all, you can just give me a call. Thanks, but it's all memorized. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> so Mr. Wheeler has a computer? His granddaughter Betty sent it to him so they could talk face to face. And I went over to the store and taught him how it works. Computers aren't easy to use the first time. Wasn't it difficult for him? Uh-uh. He was so excited to talk to Betty, it didn't take long at all. So did he make a video call? No, not yet. They're in a different time zone over there. So he'll call her later. Good. It's time. Mm. Mm. Betty? I'm well. I'd love to talk to you face to face. I'm all ready to go. So, this button turns it on. Huh. What's wrong? Oh, dear. It's not plugged in. Now. 
Hey, it's not working. Huh? Oh! Oh, no! I forgot the voltage converter! Ah, I have to pull this out now. Ah, that's hot! Ah, ah, fire! I wonder if Mr. Wheeler's on the computer with Betty. Mm -hmm. He has to be thrilled since he hasn't seen his granddaughter since she was a baby. Huh? Rescue team, this is Jen. Ah, Mr. Wheeler! Did you have fun with your computer? Jin! Trouble! There's a fire at the store! Fire, fire at the, the store? store? The plug fell out and I forgot to use the voltage converter! First, it's really dangerous to stay inside of the store. Get out and I'll send the rescue team. <laughs> dangerous to stay there. You'll be much safer if you stand over there. Amber, help Mr. Wheeler. All right. Helly, keep everything under control. Roy, let's get in there and put out the fire. Got, Got it. it. Mr. Wheeler, Roy will make sure the fire gets put out. Come with me. All right. Oh, dear. My store. Holy, we need to turn off the power first. Right. Over there. It's off. Great. It wasn't a big fire, and we put it out quickly. But I'm huh? afraid that your computer's ruined. I can't believe what a careless mistake I've made. I've let down poor Betty. Don't be too hard on yourself. The important thing is that you're all right. Betty will be glad of that. I agree. Stay positive. Holy's right. right! Yes, I'm fine. But still, Betty was looking forward to seeing me. Oh. Hey, Mr. Wheeler, why don't you send Betty some pictures of yourself? Uh, pictures? Right. Sending pictures will let Betty know you're thinking of her. That way, Betty will always have the pictures to look at whenever she starts to miss you. That's a good idea. Oh, boy! I'll be the photographer! Oh, you do that for me? I'd love to. Excellent. Looks like you've rescued me <laughs> twice. <laughs> Great, Mr. Wheeler. <laughs> now, time to take your picture. <clears throat> Say cheese. Cheese. Great. Ooh. Great. Now a different pose. Awesome. Oh, yes. You look like you do this all the time. You're right about that. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go. There are lots of nice pictures in there. These photos are just great. Thanks, Helly. <laughs> well, I had a great model. <laughs> <laughs> now all you need to do is to send them to Betty and you'll be all set. Huh. I wonder if there's a way to send them quickly. Holy, maybe we could go and ask Maureen. I heard he's getting ready to set sail for the same country Betty's living in. Yeah, then the pictures will get there in no time. That's great. <laughs> Let's go and see. All set. <laughs> 
<laughs> Marine, take care of it. Thank you for giving it to my granddaughter. My pleasure, Mr. Wheeler. I'll make sure I catch up on all the latest news. I'll fill you in as soon as I get back. Thanks again. Bye, Marine. My lovely granddaughter, Betty. I miss you more than I can say. Please come and visit Broomstown soon. <laughs> we'll meet my wonderful rescue team friends. Love, Grandpa. Trash Commotion. today. It's all right. I'll see you soon. Bye, Bye Queenie. Queenie. <sighs> 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 oh, everything fell out. They're so careless. Oh. I think that's good. If we leave it like this, Cleanie will come take it. Let's get back to work. Oh, All right. right. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh no, it's way too much for me. It's going to take me a while. Aluminum goes here, and glass here, and paper goes in this one. Huh? Uh, uh, there's gum in here! Oh, get it off me! Oh. 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 I just rolled in super glue! Now I'm stuck! Oh. Oh. Good morning. Good morning, Polly. Take care. Huh? Wow, the square is such a mess. I guess Cleany didn't come, but he should have. Yeah, he definitely should be here by now. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Cleany's late this morning. Jen. Huh? Who are you waiting for? <laughs> Cleanie never came to pick up the trash today. I'm a little bit worried about him. There's never been a time he's been this late. Oh. Uh. What? 
So Cleany never showed up here either? No. And he's never been late a single day. By this time, he normally has the entire square clean. I just came from the square and it was a mess. Cleany never showed up. I wonder what's slowing him down. Maybe something happened to him and he couldn't do his job. Maybe. Oh, I hope he's okay. Don't worry, I'll go over and see if something happened. Cleany! Where is he? Whoa, he definitely hasn't cleaned up anything here either. Help me! Someone save me! Cleany! <laughs> How did you get stuck in there? Oh, stop right there! What? Oh, no, no, I think it's super glue. I'm totally stuck. Oh, you have to help me, Cleany. But I'm stuck too, uh, Helly. Oh. oh. Oh, yeah. I told you to stop where you were. Oh, I think we need to call for some reinforcement. It's been a while. You haven't heard from him? Hmm, not at all. Huh? Uh. Hallie, did you find Cleany? Yes, I found him, but we're both kind of stuck here for a while. Stuck? What do you mean? It's a long story. Please just come and help us. Okay, Hallie. Help, help is on its way. All right. Uh, they're here. Hmm. Hmm. Wait, Wait. Here you are. What happened, oh. Helly? Well, as you can see, some super glue spilled on the ground. And then Cleany and I both got our wheels stuck. I guess that explains why Cleany never oh. showed up to clean today. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Could you please unstick us? Mm -hmm. Don't worry. I think I can handle that. <laughs> See if you can move. We can. <laughs> Oh, it worked for me, too! Thank you, Amber! No problem. <laughs> by the way, Cleany, were you trying to clean up this whole mess by yourself when you got stuck? Well, kind of, because the machine broke down and everything piled up. I see. But don't worry, Cleany. We'll help clean up. You will? Of course! Thank you so much! <laughs> <laughs> hey, what if everyone in Broomstown came to help? We'd be done in no time, if we all work together. Amber, that's a great idea. Yeah, I'll go get everybody. <laughs> hey, guys, we're here. <laughs> Hello, Hello, everyone. everyone. Hello. Hello. Well, Cleany, we're sorry we haven't appreciated all the hard work you've done. We're sorry, too. From now on, we'll help as much as we can. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, since everyone's here, should we all get to work? Bottles go in here, and cans go in here. And plastic goes in this bin. Oh. 
<laughs> All right, Dump. Okay. now. It looks like we're all finished. Wow! Thank you for all of your help today, everybody! <laughs> You're <laughs> welcome! <laughs> I, for one, had no idea that Broomstown generated so much waste. Mr. Wheeler's right. We should make an effort to reduce how much we throw away. We should think of ways that we can recycle. Mm -hmm. Many items can be used in different ways. You're right! So if we cut back on our trash and recycle what we can, we'll really be helping the environment. In that way, we can keep Broomstown beautiful, and it'll be good for all of us as well. It looks like we learned a lot today, all thanks to Cleanie. <laughs> Wait, your sorter's still broken. Want me to fix it real quick? Really? Sure. For me, it'll be a piece of cake. Jin? Huh? When you fix it, can you make it so we can just throw anything in there? That way, nobody has to worry about recycling. Bruner, uh, have you heard anything that we've said? I, I was just kidding. Really? <laughs> Bruner's new ball. make out. Not that well. The rain caused some big problems. How serious are the damages? I shot some video so I could show you guys. As you can see, flash flooding ripped some of the planks off of the bridge. The road and entrance to the tunnel are both closed due to these fallen rocks. And the road in front of the post office needs some repairs. That's some heavy duty damage. Yeah. We should get started on the repairs right huh. away. Right. I'll contact Mr. Builder. He can handle the road reconstruction. We have to do our best today. Right. right. One, two... Hey, Bruder. Oh. Huh? Hello. Hey, guys, watch this. Check it out. Whoa. It's a gold Super Ball. It bounces much higher than a regular ball, and it has this shining light. Awesome. Please let us play with it. Uh -huh. <laughs> no way. This ball was really hard to find. Bruner, just one time? No, I don't want it to get broken. So he just called us over to brag? He did. Uh -huh. One, two. Bruner? Yeah, that scared me. Whew. Mr. Builder. How many times have I told you not to play here? It's too dangerous. Sorry, Mr. Builder. I'll go put it away. <laughs> Those guys won't find it under here. <laughs> hiding the ball, hiding the ball. Oh, nothing, I'm just hiding the ball. Oh, yeah, my gold super ball. Helly, are you done yet? Uh, just about. <laughs> Bruner! <sighs> yes? Come here, please. Right. Here I am. I need you to run over to the post office with me. Huh? The rain caused some damage to the road, and I want to check it out. Then we'll know what we need to do before we start the job. Fine. We should get going, then. Dump, we'll be right back. Take your time, Bruner. Oh. Max, let's have a little break. Oh. <laughs> we could play ball if you want. We're not supposed to play at the site. Mr. Builder would be upset. Besides, we don't even have a ball. <sighs> 
Actually, I know where Bruner hid his ball. Really? Where is it? It's beautiful. We'll just play for a little bit. Then we'll put it back and he won't know a thing. He'll never notice it. Come on, let's play before Bruner comes back. <laughs> Good job, Bruner. That got done really quickly, thanks to you. <laughs> no prob. I should go talk to Mickey about pouring some new concrete to fill the hole. You can go back to the construction site and wait there with your friends. Sure, okay. And go directly to the construction site. No playing ball. Fine. Oh, no. We need to grab that ball. Okay. Huh? Gosh, I wonder whose dirty ball that one is. It's not as cool as mine. Huh? Oh, that was Dump and Poke. Max, what could they all be doing? <sighs> Max! Huh? Oh, hi, Bruner. <laughs> so where are you guys going? No, I didn't catch the ball, so we're going to pick it up. Ball? Whose ball is that? Actually, I'm sorry, Bruner. It's yours. <laughs> what? My golden Super Ball? No! Ball! <laughs> come back! <laughs> yeah, it's Bruner. Come back here! Bruner! <laughs> Stop bouncing! Oh no, my ball! I can't believe I only got to play with my ball once! <laughs> Bruner, I'm sorry about this. You, take the responsibility. What are you going to do? <laughs> Wait, I know what we can do. Oh really? Because you're never going to find a new one. The stream. The stream flows under the Splashdown Bridge, which isn't that far from here. And I know a shortcut. We'll catch the ball. Really? Yes, of course. Oh. Oh. Well, where is it? You said it would be here. Right there. Huh? It's coming around that bed. Oh, yeah? Huh? It's my ball! Huh? Yeah. Oh. Huh. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Got it! That... Ah. My oh. ball! Come back! Oh. 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 All right, Polk! <laughs> what do we do? The current is sweeping him away. We should call the rescue team right now. How are the repairs coming along? They're coming along, but we need to block the entrance huh? to the bridge. The bridge and the fishing site are both extremely weak. As for the tunnel, the fallen rocks have been cleared. Traffic can pass through it now. All right. Good job, you guys. Huh? Uh. Hi, this is Jin speaking. Jin, Poke just fell in the stream near the Splashdown Bridge. He, he did? did? And as you know, that stream flows right to the ocean. All right, I'll send the rescue team right away. Poke should be headed toward the drawbridge. Go on ahead and see if he's there. We don't want him to reach the ocean. I'm on it! He 
you okay? Uh-huh. Holy, I'm here with Poke. Hurry up! He's headed straight for the ocean! Hold on! We're on our way! <laughs> hey, Poke! Huh? Don't worry! Uh -huh. With this, he'll float! Uh -huh. But I wish they'd hurry up! Roy, you hold Poke on the other side of the stream. We'll hold him on this side. Got it. <laughs> Poke! <laughs> Hang in there, Poke. Holy, hurry up! Almost there. <laughs> now! Huh? <laughs> Roy, we'll hold it steady. Pull him in slowly. Yeah, okay. So glad you're safe, Poke. You were lucky. It's dangerous to go near a stream after a rainstorm. <laughs> this was all my fault, not his. I'm the one who wanted to play with Bruner's new gold ball. No way. I shouldn't be bragging about it. I should have just let you play. Sorry, you guys. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's time you guys got back. Mr. Builder will worry. Mr. Builder? We, we forgot! forgot. <sighs> oh, yeah, hey, Polly. Can I have my ball back now, please? Not yet. I'll hold it for now, until we get back into town. What? Oh, please give it back, Polly. You don't understand. I can't be without it another minute. Not just yet. Holy! You'll get it back. Oh, come on, you don't know what you're doing to me! No. <laughs> huh? I want it. Where did I put it? I can't believe it. I really can't lose that thing. <laughs> Hi, Minnie. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing today, Polly? <laughs> What is it that you're looking for? A ribbon that my grandpa gave me. Oh, I'll be sad if I can't find it. Oh, my. If I happen to see it, I'll make sure I bring it right to you. Thanks. Oh. Huh? It's Mr. Wheeler. I wonder why he's in such a hurry today. Ta-da! What is that thing? Well, it's a snow globe, of course. Ooh. Betty gave it to me. Can you believe that she saved up all her own pocket money to buy it for me? Isn't she the sweetest thing? Yes, she's very kind. But you know my Minnie treats her grandpa better than anybody. Oh, Minnie's a fine girl. But do you recall when my dear Betty bought me that new computer system? Right, the computer that caught on fire. What? Hmm. Minnie had a pair of glasses made for me because my eyes were so bad. Ah, and they were broken when you got oh, them. How could you? <laughs> Relax, I'm joking. <laughs> Oh, dear. Cleanie's coming in soon to get some new tires. I nearly forgot. Well, take care. I'll go with you. I was just about to leave myself. Fine. Shall we? Well, everything looks good out here. I guess I'll head back. Uh, what's that? A ribbon. I 
wonder who left it here. Well, I guess I'll bring it back with me. I'm home, Grandpa. Huh? <gasps> what is that? Oh, I wonder whose it is. It's beautiful. Huh? What's with the ribbon? I found Ooh. it when I was out. I was hoping to find its owner. Uh -huh. Any idea whose it might be? Let's, Let's see. see. It looks like the kind of ribbon that somebody would wear. Huh? I'm back, guys. Hi, Hi Polly. Polly, I just found this on my patrol. Do you know who it belongs to? Oh, it's a ribbon. Where did you pick it up? It was near Mr. Musty's house. Well, then, I have a feeling that that ribbon belongs huh? to Minnie. She said she mm -hmm. lost one. She was really upset. Wow. Huh? Well, I guess I'll go back and look into it then. <laughs> That's much better. Thank you, Mr. Wheeler. Goodbye. Come again. Well, now I can admire my snow globe. Hmm. Huh? There's no snow globe in here. I must have left it at Mr. Musty's. I'll go back for it now. <laughs> it's magical. Mr. Musty. Huh? Musty, are you home? I'm sorry. He's not home, Mr. Wheeler. He's not? Minnie, have you seen my new snow globe by any chance? What's a snow globe? It's a small glass ball. It has snow falling inside. <laughs> sorry, but I haven't seen your snow globe. How strange. I thought I left it right over here, but it's certainly not here now. Well, I guess it's possible that I dropped it on the way. Yes, I suppose that's what happened. Well, Minnie, thanks anyway. Sure. Oh, what have I done? I've lied to Mr. Wheeler. Hello, Minnie. Oh, it wasn't me. I mean, hi there. Oh, did I scare uh, you? Uh, oh, no, you didn't. <laughs> Minnie, you'll never guess what I have for you. Ta-da! It's yours, right? It's my ribbon. Where did you find it? It was on a fence down the street. There you go. All set. Thank you so much, <laughs> Helly. It was mm -hmm. a gift from my grandpa. I was so sad when I thought I lost it. I see. I'm glad I found it then. Be careful you don't lose it again. See you later. I'll see you soon. <laughs> So, so it, it was Minnie's, Minnie's ribbon? ribbon? Yep. It was just the way Polly was oh. telling us earlier. Oh. It seemed like she'd been looking for it for some time. I guess that must have been a special ribbon. She said it was a gift from Mr. Musty. Mm -hmm. Anyway, mm -hmm. I'm glad that the oh. lost ribbon was finally found. Mm. Mm. Where is it? I've retraced every step I took. Huh? What's this? Could it have rolled down there? Huh. Oh, is that it? It's a paint can. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, Mr. Wheeler! 
Myself. I can't move my leg. Stay very still. We're going to get you out. Amber, you go down first and see what you can do for his leg. Mm-hmm. Pulley, huh. the ramp's right there. Great. While Amber's checking on his leg, you two work to get him out. Got, Got it. it. <laughs> We're here. We'll be right there. Amber, you go ahead. Thank you. Let's see. It hurts. I'll treat your leg. Try to be as still as you can. All right. Holy, while I work on his leg, will you bring a stretcher? Of course. Don't worry, Mr. Wheeler. You're a lifesaver. <laughs> Thank you. All ready. Right. Roy, we're all set. All right. Okay, pull him up now. All right. Now, Mr. Wheeler. <laughs> this wouldn't have happened if I hadn't gone in the construction site. I shouldn't have been looking in there. It's all my fault. <laughs> I should have given it back right from the start. I just thought it was so pretty that I lied to you. <laughs> Don't worry, Minnie. It's easy to act that way when you find something without its owner. Yes, that's right. But you realized your mistake and you did something to fix it. That's right. Mm -hmm. You were brave to admit what you did. Yes, indeed. You were very brave. Thank you for bringing my snow globe back. You're welcome. I just gave it back to its original owner. <laughs> <laughs> Amber, would you take Mr. Wheeler to the hospital? All right. Nice and slow now. Thank you, everybody. You're, you're welcome. welcome. There, you're all ready. <laughs> we'll be back. Bye, Bye Mr. Wheeler. Mr. Wheeler, get well soon. Where are you, Jin? You're, You're leading, leading your, your own, own nature, nature field, field trip? trip? Yes. I'll lead kids into the woods so they can experience nature firsthand. Wow, Jin. Huh. That's a great idea. Uh, yes. And it'll be a great experience for the children. We'll hold things down here so you'll have nothing to worry about. Aw, oh, thanks. I knew you guys would understand. Ellie, could you put these posters up around town? No problem. I'm your man. Wow. I know the kids will love that. It's open to any children who live in Broomstown, so spread the word. <laughs> All right. I'll tell everybody after school. Thanks, Scooby. <laughs> Let's see. I've got a map and a compass and a flashlight. That's it. I'm all set. The kids are going to be so excited in the morning. I can't wait till tomorrow. <laughs> Huh? One, <laughs> two, three? Uh, Are you the only ones? Yes! yes. You're kidding! Uh, oh. Uh, you know, Tim and Tom are home watching television, and Sam, John, Sean, and Allie are... They're all playing computer games. 
The only reason I'm here right now is because my computer's in the shop. What? But this is much more fun than playing on the computer. You don't have to try so hard. Just keep me from getting bored. Of course. You're going to beg me to come back. So, Annie, Mary, and Andy, shall we leave now? Yeah! yeah. Jin! Huh? Are you sure you have everything you need for the trip? Don't worry. I double-checked everything. See you soon. Have a great time. <laughs> <laughs> Off we go. Yay! Yay! Uh -oh. Have, Have fun, fun, kids. kids. <laughs> Here we are, everyone. Ah. Oh. <clears throat> School bee. Please pick us back up by five. <laughs> All right. See you later. Have fun, too. <laughs> Bye, Bye Scooby. Scooby. Well, are you ready to go and explore the forest? Yeah. <laughs> so the first thing you need to know about the forest is that it can be unpredictable. You might come across a wild animal or a poisonous plant or insect, so stick together. Right. right. Once, my parents took me to the woods. Mm. Really? <laughs> huh? Andy, stay close, okay? Okay. <laughs> huh? Oh, uh, uh, Jin? Yes? What is it that huh? you keep doing? Uh, I'm tying the ribbons to mark our trail. This will make it much easier for us to find our way back home, you see? Wow, that's, that's so cool! cool. Bah. Huh? That's super basic knowledge. Wow, Andy, you're pretty smart. Ah, that was nothing. Huh? <laughs> oh, wow, huh? what is huh? that? Isn't this Bracken? That's, that's Bracken? Bracken? See the rolled up shape? I think it's so <laughs> cute. This huh? plant has been around since before the dinosaurs roamed on dinosaurs? Earth. Dinosaurs? Wow, that is so amazing! <laughs> don't you agree with them, Andy? I don't care. <laughs> okay, <laughs> then maybe we should go someplace else. Huh? Hmm. Huh? So what are we going to see next? Tiger Swallowtail. Really? Wait for me! Across this stream, there's a place where many tiger swallowtails make their home. They lay eggs and raise caterpillars there. Wait and see. Huh? Huh? Andy! I got you. Huh? Oh no, Jin. Is it broke? It's okay. Nothing's broken at all. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Ta da! Ew, gross! This is a tiger swallowtail caterpillar. An adult swallowtail lays its eggs on the plant, and eventually they become caterpillars. Hmm. Ah, look here! First it becomes a pupa, then the adult swallowtail comes out of that. A butterfly's going to come out of there? Mm-hmm. Cool, right? It is cool. Hmm? Huh? Huh? What's with this weather? Huh? Huh? All right, let's stay dry in that cave. Right! <laughs> It will be a while before the rain stops. The way it's raining, I think the bridge will be flooded. I think I should let the rescue team know. Huh? Not working? Do you think when you huh? dropped it earlier that it might have gotten broken? I'm sure it'll work. All right, so we're just going to have to wait here until it stops raining. Sure. sure. Wow, it's huh? really raining. Oh, I hope Jin and the kids are all right. Mm. We'd better call and check to make sure that they're okay. I can call from here. 
Jin? Jin? Can you hear me? Jin? She's not picking up. Oh, no. Maybe something happened to her and the kids. Yeah. There's no reason she couldn't be reached out there. Huh. I don't like it. I think we should head to the woods. Let's, Let's go! go. This is all my fault. I'm sorry. No, it was my mistake. I'll get it fixed later. <laughs> Does this mean we can't go home now? There is nothing to worry about. The rescue team will get us out of here. Are, Are you, you sure? sure? They will. Why don't we sing a song while we wait for them? Good, Good idea. idea. I mm. want to go first. What are you talking about? <laughs> you can't sing. Huh? How would you know? I'm a mm. great singer. Let's look around for some kind of a trail marker. Here's one. This way. Great. Come on. <laughs> Here. The trail markers end right here. Where's that, that coming from? Um, it sounds like it's coming from over there. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, Andy. Amber and I are right here to help you. Yeah, pretend you're on the playground. Go on, it's actually a whole lot of fun. Come on, you can do it. Oh, oh. here goes. Ah! 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 <laughs> you did great. <laughs> it wasn't as bad as I thought. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming to get us. I should have kept a closer eye on the weather forecast. I guess I don't make the best field trip leader. That's not true. You did great. You kept the children safe. Yeah, you stayed calm and kept the kids happy until help came. You stayed away from the flooded river, and you used trail markers. We're proud to call you a part of the rescue team. Most of all, this was an awesome field trip. So much better than some lame computer game. Yeah, can we come back tomorrow? <laughs> I'll bring all my friends next time. Really? Oh, thank you, children. Oh, I can't breathe. Let me go. <laughs> <laughs> The Secret of Poke. This is a problem. Mr. Builder. Hello, Mr. Builder. Well, hello there. 
You look like something's bothering you. Well, there is. I'm supposed to pave this road, but as you see, this tree is right in the way. Hmm. That is a problem, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. What is it? What if we took this lovely tree and planted it elsewhere? Yeah. But where exactly would we be able to plant a tree this big? Don't worry <laughs> about it. We'll look until we find a suitable place. You'll do that? Yes. That's so kind of you. No, no problem. problem. Transplant a tree? Yes. Oh. Mr. Builder is paving the road, and there is a big tree blocking it. And it's such a beautiful tree. If we find the right place for it, it'll make awesome shade. This is a great idea. If we do this, we'll be doing a favor yes. for both Mr. Builder and the tree. <laughs> Cool. I'll go and start looking for the right place to plant the tree. <laughs> it's time for me to start digging. Huh? Oh, there's a flower here. Bruner, come and help me. All right. Oh. Can you dig there for me? Um. Uh -oh. A little more, you're almost done. Huh? Poke, where are you going? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think? Looks, Looks good. good. There's good sunshine and good soil. I think it's the perfect place for our tree. It would be better if we added a bench. Yes, a nice place to sit in the shade. So, do we all agree that this is the spot? Yes! yes. <laughs> <laughs> Now where is Poke going? Huh? He left again? Something strange is going on here. Poke! What's going on? You're up to something. Huh? Don't say that you're not. You're not hiding anything? I know there's something going on. With the tree out of the way, you can start paving the road. Thank you. Well, goodbye, old tree. Okay, Terry. Be careful. Don't worry, Polly. Let's follow them. Yes! Huh? Hey, guys, look, there goes Polk again. What? Good. I'll follow him and find out what's been going on. I'll be back. Huh? Where is he going? Huh? Oh, no! Close. Huh? No. Oh, no. I lost him. Oh. Huh. Oh. 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 Let's put it right over there. Okay. I think we're almost done here. Roy, could you please give the tree a drink? Of course. <laughs> what? You lost him? And he was right in front of my nose. I lost my chance to find out his secret. Hey, guys. Huh? Nice, nice to, to see you, Mr. Builder. Builder. 
You two fellas. Hmm? Hang on. Where's Polk? He went somewhere and hasn't come back yet. Mm -hmm. Really? We need to start paving the road. Oh, well then. Come on. We'll have to start without him. Fine. Oh. There you are. What are you doing here, Poke? Yeah. Well, it's a good thing we found you, Poke. Let's get to work. Yeah. yeah. We're going to pave the road and install a lamppost. So, Bruner, start digging. Right about here. Poke, you can help load this dirt on the dump. Max, you start packing down this dirt. Sure. You wanted me to dig here, right? Yes. Here we go. No, no. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Uh -huh. I'll go after him. He's not going to lose me this time. What on earth is going on here? Polk, slow down! Where are you going? Polk! I found him. Oh, watch it! Look out! Watch it next time! Poke! Poke, are you okay? Just stay there. I'll get some help. So the tree got moved? That's great! Terry's help was invaluable. We couldn't have done it without him. That's true, and the tree looks wonderful in its new home, Jin. Sounds like Helly oh. really found the perfect place. <laughs> <laughs> Everything worked out. Now the tree is growing in a new spot, and Mr. Builder is able to start paving the road. Huh? Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin, Polk was in an accident. He's collapsed at the 12th Street intersection. What? He's in the road. It's dangerous. Don't worry, Bruner. The rescue team is on the way. Fly on ahead to the scene and take control. Okay. Tell me what's going on with you, please. Poke! Huh? Helly! Don't you worry, Poke. The rest of the team is coming. Hang in there, buddy. Huh? You're here! Are you hurt? Hmm. Roy, help me get Poke up. Sure. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Amber, check and see if he's all right. Okay. Uh. Hmm? Terry, stop! What's happening? There was a problem. We're taking care of it, but it would be better if you took a different route. Oh, I'll go a different way then. Thank you, Terry. It's okay, but I need to make sure you're all right, Poke. <laughs> Poke! Amber, do you think he might be in pain? I need to take a closer look. How is Poke? Well, Amber's been checking him out, but it seems like he's hardly moving at all. Holy, I think we should take Poke back to headquarters for a thorough medical checkup. Uh, Poke? Just hang in there. We're going to take you back to headquarters. <laughs> What's going on? Huh? A flower? There's a flower in his shovel. A, a flower? flower? 
This flower was at our construction site. Hulk, have you been trying to protect this flower? Uh-huh. Of course. Now I know Polk's secret. Secret? <laughs> yes. So this is the famous flower? Pretty. <laughs> Polk, Bruner told us everything. The next time something like this happens, please tell us. Yeah. We'd like to help. <laughs> Actually, the tree and the flower are really well matched. Yeah, they look great together. <laughs> like us? Like us? Like us? <laughs> yes, like you all. <laughs> <laughs> Weird School Bee. As all of you already know, today is Broomstown's cleanup day. So I thought we could all paint our headquarters. Would you like to help? Of, of course, course, Jen. Why don't we all paint different sections? I'll do the paint on the roof, windows. And Roy and I will be taking care of the walls. Sure. Good. Then that just leaves the entrance. I'll paint that. I think that's everything. Then let's get to work. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Bruner, hmm? can you push the ladder a bit? Yes, Mr. Builder. <laughs> hey, push it slower, Bruner. <laughs> I'm sorry. Huh? It's Scooby. Oh, look at that. Scooby's covered in white spots. Isn't it funny? <laughs> Scooby. Huh? Hello, Mr. Builder. Hello, Bruner. What's up with hmm. the spots? I passed by a building that was being painted, and white paint splashed all over me. Goodness. When you pass a building that's being painted, you should take care. So I learned. Huh? You're painting? Could you please paint over these white spots with yellow paint? I'm sorry, huh? but we don't have any yellow huh? paint. Hmm. What should I do? I hate these awful, ugly white spots. Oh! <laughs> ah, hey, what if we just painted Scooby white all over? Are you talking about an all-white Scooby? Yes, yes, please. That would be so much better than all of these spots. Hmm. All right, we'll try. <laughs> All done. Let's take a look. Huh? Uh... <laughs> How do I look? Well, uh... Amazing, uh... Scooby. Uh... Really? That's so awesome! Thanks, Mr. Builder and Bruner. Uh... I'll see you both later. Wait a minute! <laughs> Will he be okay? He'll be fine. <laughs> All done. I'm finished as well. I'm also done. Wow, our headquarters look absolutely wonderful. Ellie, are you all done? Just finished up. <laughs> huh? oh, I'm sorry, Amber. I accidentally dripped paint on you. It's fine, Helly. But it looks like you got paint all over yourself, too. Really? Ugh! Oh, no! I'm covered in stains! We all look the huh? same, Helly. Oh, my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, everyone. I'll make sure all of you are clean again. There! It's all done! Wow! I look even better than before. Thank you, Jin. Sure. Okay, Roy, you're next. Yeah. I'll paint you in no time. Thank you, Jin. <laughs> la, 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 la. I am Scooby. The kids love me, don't you know? And I love them so. Da, 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 da. And now it's Amber's turn. Jin, huh? that's red, isn't it? Of course. Without the red paint, I couldn't make pink paint. Check it out. If I mix white paint with red paint... Ta-da! I get pink! 
Wow, that's awesome! <laughs> Here we go! Good as new! Thank you, Jin! It's my turn now! <laughs> huh. I need to paint you green, so... Hmm. If I mix yellow and blue, I get green! Like so! Good! Are you ready? I don't have any more yellow paint. What? But you're not done yet. You're right. Don't worry. What we'll do is order more paint from the store. Oh. Hmm. What? Oh, you don't. Well, please let me know when you get it back in stock, okay? Oh. What happened? I'm sorry, mm -hmm. Helly. But a lot of people have been looking for yellow paint today. The store sold no. out. What am I going to do now? I think you have to wait until tomorrow. What? Mm -hmm. But I just can't go around like this all day. Aww. This is awful. Scooby! Hi, kids! Ugh. Hey, Scooby, what on earth happened to you? There were some spots of white paint that got spilled onto me, so they decided to paint me all white. Cool, right? No way, uh, you look uh, like a ghost! What? A ghost? Rescue team, this is Jen. Oh, you have it? Thank you so much. We'll pick it up. Ah, uh, Helly! Yes? They have the yellow paint now. They do? Mm-hmm. They told me that I can pick it up any time. They must have gotten it sooner than expected. Yay! I'll go get it! Yippee! <laughs> A ghost? Do I really look that weird? Mm, let me take a look. Oh, oh my! I do look like a ghost. No! Oh no! I shouldn't have painted myself all white. <laughs> all right, I have to find yellow paint right now. Oh no! <laughs> oh, my tire is stuck. Oh, oh no! Please help! Oh no! Please help! I got the yellow paint. <laughs> Finally. So the yellow paint is here? Yes. <laughs> I know Helly was happy. I know he'll come back with a smile on his face. Huh? That's him now. Helly, what's going on? Scooby has fallen into the stream near the post office. I'll send you the video. Okay. Oh, help! Scooby! Why is Scooby white? What happened to him, Helly? I don't know, but you all need to get over here right away. Okay, Helly. We'll all be right there. Scooby, we're here to help. Amber, can you take a look at that tire? Holy, I found the problem. I'll try moving the rock. It's done. Good job, Amber. Hey, Polly, I think it's better if we pick him up and move him. There are just so many rocks around. 
Roy, let's lift him up and out of the stream. Oh, right. Ready? I'm ready. Okay, on three. One, two, three. All right, go. Be careful. So then Mr. Builder painted you white? I didn't want to be all covered in spots. I know how you felt, but now I need to get back to the way I used to look. Otherwise, the students won't want to ride me anymore. Calm down, Scooby. This is a can of yellow paint. We'll have you back to your old color before you know it. You guys will help, right? Of, of course. course. You will? Thank you so much, friends. <laughs> <laughs> Now, let's make sure Schoolby's good and yellow. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that tickles! Stop moving, Schoolby, or I can't paint you properly. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's the school bee we know. <laughs> oh, good. Thank you so much. <laughs> You're welcome. Look, Jin, we're all covered in paint spots again. Oh. Not a problem. I'll just have to paint you all again. Why don't we start with you this time? Really? <laughs> Yahoo! Oh, we have a problem. What? We're out of yellow paint again. What? I have to wait again? Oh, no. I demand to be painted right now. <laughs> <laughs> huh. Brave Mr. Musty. A couple of days ago, there was a report of a child almost getting kidnapped one town over. Really? Was the suspect caught? Huh? No, not yet. The suspect is a container truck known only as X. He's hard to catch because he's a master of disguise, as you can see. So, even if he is in town, it will be tricky because we won't recognize him. Shouldn't we try to come up with some kind of plan? Yes, let's get the word out and have people report if they see a suspicious truck. And we should alert children to be extra careful. Okay! okay. What? That's terrible! So, Posty, if you see a suspicious truck, please report it right away. Of course! I'll spread the word as well. That's great! Hmm. Well, I haven't seen any suspicious customers. That's good. If you do, please report it to us right away. I will. Goodbye, then. Goodbye, Amber. Please tell all of the children to make sure that they don't talk to any strangers at all. Even if he or she is very nice. I'll let the kids know. If some stranger asks you for your help or asks you for directions, first say no. Then make sure you tell an adult. But I thought not helping people when they ask was bad. Grown-ups should not be asking children to help them. If one does, saying no doesn't make you a bad person. You got that? Yes! Even if a stranger offers you candy or a toy, don't follow them anywhere. Okay! okay. <laughs> You're all smart kids. I'll let you know if I see a strange truck, Bully. Thanks a lot, Mr. Musty. Hmm. I have to go now. Goodbye. See you later. Goodbye, Bully! <sighs> I can't believe someone would hurt children. If I got a hold of that monster, I'd teach him a lesson. What would you do? He's right. It's not like you're strong or anything. Rascals, you haven't heard the story of how I stopped the dam from collapsing. I don't believe it. No way. How could you stop a dam from collapsing? <laughs> you don't believe me? It's a true story. Are you two guys calling my grandfather a liar? Hmm. Oh, Minnie's mad. Why are you angry? What? <laughs> Stop this, kids. It's not worth fighting over. Benny, oh. let's just go to the toy store by ourselves. Okay. Okay. We're gonna head on out now. 
All right. Come on, Benny. Don't be mad at them, Minnie. <laughs> Grandpa, did you really stop a dam from collapsing? Yes, I really did. <laughs> I did. <sighs> That's a relief. Uh, oh, yeah, the toy store. Grandpa, let's go to the toy store. Sure, let's get to it. Hurry, Grandpa. We have to get there before Rody and Benny do. Okay, okay. <laughs> Holy! Huh? Roy, what's the situation? It's quiet. No sign of a strange truck yet. Right! Good. But well, let's all keep looking anyway. Okay. okay. Hurry up! Hello! Hello there. Mr. Musty, where are you going? Well, I'm going to the toy store with the children. <laughs> That's nice. So, how's the store? Same as it ever was. Mr. Musty, can we go on ahead to the store? Mm -hmm. huh? All right. I'll catch up with you kids in just a little while. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Did you hear the big news? Ah, you mean about Truck X? Yes. Can you believe it? Oh, no. It's closed. Well, should we just go home? No. Hello, children. Uh, huh? It's too bad. You must be bummed that the store's closed. Yes, we are. But who are you? Why, I'm a toy delivery truck. I forgot the toy store's closed today, too. If you were hoping to shop for toys, would you like to take a look at some of mine? Really? Sure. <laughs> You can get in and play with anything you want. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh. Wait, don't you remember what Polly said? We're just gonna take a look. Yeah, just for a little while. Okay, mm. just for a minute, all right? <laughs> I hope the children are having fun. Huh? What? What is going on? Huh? Mister, what, what are you doing? doing? Oh, children! <laughs> stop! You stop right now! Oh, help us! <laughs> stop! No! Oh, what do I do now? Of course! Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin, help, please. That truck was here in town and he's taken the children. Oh, no. Emergency, emergency. What is it, Jin? Mr. Musty just reported that Truck X oh. just kidnapped three children from town. He's disguised as a toy delivery truck huh? and headed towards the Windhill intersection with the children. Rescue team, move out. Let's move. What should I do? If I sit here and do nothing, Truck X will get away. I have to do something so he can't leave town. Wait, there's a shortcut I used to take near here. I'm coming, kids. I will save you all. Oh, here he comes. Oh, that's it. What is this? The road's blocked? I guess I'll just have to go this way instead. <sighs> yes, it worked! That road will lead him straight into the tunnel. The rescue team can catch him now. <sighs> Mr. Musty! Holy! Truck X is headed toward the tunnel now. You have to hurry. Yes. Thanks so much, Mr. Musty. Helly, fly ahead and find out exactly where the truck is. Okay. We have to catch him before he reaches the tunnel. Let's move out. Okay! Hang in 
there, Minnie. Huh? Got him! That must be why they call him Truck X! Holy! Truck X is almost to the tunnel! You guys need to move! Okay, we're almost there. Let's move. children are in the truck, so we have to be careful. Let's do this. Roger! Right now, you were all foolish enough to fall for my trick. <laughs> uh, oh. Roy, Truck X is about to reach the tunnel! Okay! What? Oh. Stop, Truck X! What the fool the... Let me go! No way! Stop! Who are you? The, the Broomstown Town Rescue, Rescue Team. Team! There's no chance you're getting away. You'd better <laughs> stop now. <laughs> you think that I'm going to stop? You better look out. <sighs> better move, because I'm coming through. No, no way. way! Oh, come on! <sighs> I am so doomed. X, you are under arrest for kidnapping. <laughs> Kids, you all right? Yes. <laughs> this incident almost cost us our precious children. But thanks to the quick thinking and heroic actions of our own Mr. Musty, we were able to save them. The kids are safe. So we've gathered to present him with a bravery award. Our hero, Mr. Musty. <laughs> this is his second bravery award. Once, a long time ago, he stopped a dam from collapsing at great risk to his own life. Wow, he really was telling the truth. Wow. See, I told you my grandpa's a hero. Yes, Mr. Musty is, Musty is the best. Am I blushing? <laughs> I have still oh, got it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Please, hear me out. Okay, Mickey, can you please pour the concrete here? Sure. <laughs> Hello, Mickey. Hiya, Polly. Hello, Mr. Builder. Hello there. You must be busy installing all the water pipes. Yes, we have to install on three different sites. That's why we got such an early start. Sure. I know you're in a hurry, but please remember to be safe as well. Yes, you don't need to worry. Good. I'd better get going now. Bye Goodbye. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Mr. Builder, I'm done pouring. Uh, let's look. Hey. Uh. Good job. Thanks a lot. <clears throat> All right. Dump and Poke are waiting for us, so let's get to the last construction site, Mickey. Yeah! <laughs> hey, guys. Mr. Builder. The dirt's filled in, right? Uh -oh. Yes. Now we just have to have the concrete poured. Good job, you guys. All right, you can go, and Mickey and I will finish up here. Thanks. Oh. See you around. Mickey, pour some concrete here. Okay. I'm all out of concrete. Oh, no. 
You are? Well, then you go back and refill, and I'll just wait for you here. Okay, I'll be right back. Uh -huh. <laughs> I can't believe I ran out of concrete. Huh? It's Rudy and Benny. <laughs> hey, look. Ta-da! Wow, I want to try. Hey, guys! <laughs> what are you doing? Well... <sighs> now, where is he? I guess I could look over the blueprints. Huh? There's a missing page. Maybe I dropped it at the last sight. I should go and look for it, but I have to stay here. Huh? Mr. Builder, <laughs> we meet again. Holy, what perfect timing. I think I dropped an important blueprint, but I can't go look because I have to keep an eye on this pit. I'll be glad to watch the pit for you while you look for the blueprint. You will? Thanks so much, Polly. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> you two troublemakers! Because of you two, I have to come back here and pour concrete again! Oh, not so bad! Mickey! <laughs> Mr. Builder! You're supposed to be getting concrete. What are you doing out here? Well, I was going... Mr. Mr. Builder! We were playing, and Mickey just huh? started screaming at us and really scared huh? us. Oh, I'm huh? scared. That isn't true. Mr. Builder, please just hear me out. Be quiet. Oh. You two run along. It's not safe to play at a construction site. Yes. Mickey, go refill your concrete and get back here at once. Oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> Uh, he didn't hear me out at all, then he yelled at me. You're saying Mickey yelled at the children? Yes, he did. Oh. Well, surely he had a good reason. There was no reason. He was just acting immaturely like he always does. <laughs> oh, my. Keep the concrete, then. Give the drama spin. Oh. Mickey! Huh? Hello, Polly. Hello, Mickey. So, I just talked to Mr. Builder. What really happened with those kids? Well, I yelled at those kids because they were putting tire marks in my fresh concrete. But Mr. Builder wouldn't listen to me and only took their side. I see. Cheer up, Mickey. I'm sure Mr. Builder will understand if you tell him what happened. Oh. Mr. Builder is still waiting. Why don't you go and tell him what really happened? Okay. Don't let it get thick. That's a mixing trick. <laughs> oh. Huh? Hi, Hi, Polly. Hey, kids. How's it going? So you're playing ball? Yes. <laughs> I have something I'd like to ask the two of you. What is it? I'm wondering, did the two of you really make tire marks in the wet concrete? Mickey was telling the truth. Hey, kids, did you know Mr. Builder yelled at Mickey because of this? Yes. If you had told the truth, then Mr. Builder wouldn't have yelled at Mickey. Sorry. I'm glad you understand you were wrong, but I think you need to go and tell Mr. Builder what really happened. What? Is this true? Yes. I thought if we told you the truth, you'd yell at us. Goodness, I've made a huge mistake. Mickey has to be hurt by what I did. When he comes back, listen to what he has to say. I saw him on my way here, and he looked really sad. Yes, thank you, Polly. You've helped me resolve this mix-up. And thank you, children, for telling me the truth. You're welcome. <laughs> Keep the concrete thin. Give the drama spin. I don't want to go back. Huh? He must be waiting for me. Hmm. Mr. Builder wouldn't even listen to me. <laughs> if I don't go back, then he'll be sorry he yelled at me. That'll teach Mr. Builder a great big lesson. Huh? Huh. Hey, I can hide in here. <laughs> there. <laughs> and if I do this, they'll never find me. <laughs> he won't finish his construction today. <laughs> 
So? Is the misunderstanding all cleared up? Seems so. Mm -hmm. Mr. Builder said he talked to Mickey, so I'm sure everything's <laughs> fine. It's sad that poor Mickey had to get yelled at. Mm-hmm. If I see Benny and Rhody, I just might have to yell at them. <laughs> it's okay. They're already sorry for what they did. Yes, I'm glad Mr. Builder and Mickey made up. Huh? Why did it get so dark in here? No! There's no way out! I'm scared! No! It's hard and I'm trapped! Mickey! Huh? Mr. Builder? Golly, what am I going to do? He must have been waiting for me this whole time! He's going to yell! <laughs> now, where on earth did he go? What happened to him? Mr. Builder! Huh? I am in here! Mickey! <laughs> what in the world happened? The concrete hearted and now I can't get out! It's scary in here! <laughs> Just hang in there! I'll go call the rescue team! Rescue team, this is Jen. Mr. Builder! Oh my gosh! Don't worry, I'm sending the rescue team now! Emergency, emergency! Mickey's trapped in a tunnel near the work site. Please head out there right away! Okay! We'll get you out of there in no time. Roy, this concrete has to go. All right. Hmm. Mickey, stand back. This will be dangerous. Okay. That's good, Roy. Yep. Let's get this concrete out of the way. <laughs> Mickey? It's all done. You can come on out. wanted to hide, and that's what happened. I see. Mm -hmm. Mickey, I heard mm -hmm. what happened from Benny and mm -hmm. Rhody, and I'm sorry I didn't mm -hmm. listen to you, and I'm sorry mm -hmm. I yelled. I'm sorry, too. Nah, I was just so worried about you. I'm glad you're all right. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, Mr. Builder, what about the unfinished construction? Don't worry about that. We'll do it tomorrow. That's good, then. Uh-oh, Mr. Builder, something's happening! Huh? Like what? No. Oh. Oh. I haven't had a chance to clean my drum. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> huh. Cap is neat. Perfect. We're done here, too. Last night's rain was really fierce, but now the road's good as new. Right. I don't think driving will be a problem for anyone. So, 
Shall we head back? Yeah, although I think we should all go to a car wash first. As you can see, we're all sort of a mess. <laughs> right, good idea. Huh? Jin, what's going on? Okay, I'll check it out. Everyone, the 8th Street Road sign has fallen down. I'll go there with Roy and take care of it. Right. We'll meet up with you later on. All right. Cap! Oh. Hey, it's Spooky and Posty. Want to play, play ball? ball? Play ball? Sure. <laughs> uh, there are too many puddles to play here. I'll be a muddy mess in no time. <laughs> Hurry up, Cap. I guess. I'm covered with mud. Hey, guys, I'll be back in a little while. Uh... I wonder where Cap is going. That was weird. Hmm. Welcome to the Broomstown Car Wash. Please follow the yellow line. Amber, after you. Why, thanks, mm -hmm. Hallie. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Huh? Uh, uh, uh... Hi, Hi, Cap. I'm really sorry, but do you mind if I go through first? I'm in a big hurry. Not at all. Go ahead. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> <sighs> Welcome. Please put your transmission in neutral. <laughs> <sighs> what a relief. <sighs> Roy, I'm all done here. How's it going? Uh, that's it. I'm all done. Good job. So now I think we should take a little trip to the car wash like the others did. Sure, great idea. <laughs> this time I'll make sure I don't get messy. <laughs> Cap, catch <laughs> this! <laughs> <gasps> oh no, it's so... <sighs> Dirty. I just got washed. <sighs> Cap, you gotta catch the ball. Yeah, are you gonna play or not? Mm. Wait. I promise I'll be right back. Where, Where are, are you going, going now? now? Welcome to the Broomstown Car Wash. Please follow the yellow line. Hold on! Huh? <laughs> Hi, Cap. I'm sorry, but do you mind if I go first? <laughs> I'm in a big hurry. Of course. Please go first. Hey, thanks. <laughs> The car wash is finished. What a relief. <laughs> Next customer, please follow the yellow line. Great. Now it's my turn. Hold on. Oh. Wait once more. <sighs> Will you let me go ahead of you one more time? Why? You see, I still have mud on me. Where? See? Mm -hmm. Huh? Look closer. Huh? Go ahead. <laughs> Okay, after you. Oh, yeah. thank you. <laughs> We're back. Hi, Hi friends. friends. That sure took a long time. Fixing that road sign must have been hard work. No, no Jin. Jin. First, we both stopped at the car wash. Cap asked if he could go first, uh -huh. so we said yes. Cap came right before me, too, when I was at the car wash. He did? Wow then that means Cap got washed two whole times in one day. Uh-huh. But that's not the only time we saw. He got washed two times more. And that means Cap got washed four times in a single day. Cap must be the cleanest car ever. Huh. Getting washed is exhausting. I should tell those guys I don't want to play ball anymore. <laughs> hey, guys, I don't want to play golf. Hey, you're back. Get the ball for us, please. <laughs> I can't take it anymore! I'm huh? out of here! Uh, yeah. uh, I can't believe I'm still dirty! Welcome to the Broomstown Car Wash. Please follow the yellow line. So where did Cap go anyway? <sighs> He's not coming back. Why don't we stop? Yeah. You know, I think we should go to the car wash on the way home. Sure. 
<sighs> All of this washing. I'm tired. This time, I'm gonna make sure I'm super clean. <gasps> you have left your guide rail. Please do not move. Nah, I just need a little more soap. Just a little more. One more time can't hurt. Please do not move. Please do not move. Moving may damage the mechanism. What? What's that? <sighs> damage to the mechanism is activating the safety system. The system will shut down the more. mechanism soon. Please move hey, out of the car wash. what's going on? The mechanism is shutting down. Oh, oh no! I'm stuck! No, please help! Help me! The Somebody exit get door me out is closing. Here. Help me! You know what? Let's not play with Cap next time. I wonder where he went. Who knows? Hold on! Huh? Did you hear that noise? Get me out of here! Huh? Somebody help me! Sounds like it's inside the car wash! Let's check it out! Somebody help me! Cap? Cap, is that you inside? Hey, friends! Help me out! I'm caught between the brushes and can't move! Can't, can't move? move? I'm so scared! Stay calm! Uh, I'll call the rescue team! Uh, uh, uh. Rescue team, this is Jen. Jen, help us! What's going on, Posty? Emergency! Emergency! I just got a report about Cap being stuck in the car wash. All rescue team members, please move out! Right, right Jen! Jen. Soon, the rescue team's on its way. Here they come! <laughs> hey, friends! Holy cap stuck between the car wash brushes. Cap. We'll get you out of there. We're coming in right now. Uh, please hurry up. Uh, Holy, the car wash exit is stuck. What? Uh, this window is stuck too. This one won't open either. The safety system is activated. Helly, do you think you can shut the system down? I'll try. I'll open the exit. Doing anything! Uh, holy! Try to stay calm. Roy, I think we have no other choice but to force the exit. Right, I'll try. <laughs> Open, let's go in! Come on, Amber. Mm -hmm. Cap. Cap! You okay? Uh, holy! <laughs> Amber, please disable the system. Got it. If I hadn't kept trying to go through, I just wanted to get clean. You do like cleanliness, don't you? It's a good thing to wash. I hate getting dirty. It makes me crazy. But, Cap, if you play hard, it's only natural that you're going to get dirty. Yeah, like us. <laughs> <laughs> Amber, am I... am I weird? No, you're not weird. But still, worry too much, and it's going to keep you from having the fun that you want to have. Yeah. Wow. 
I was so worried about getting dirty, I wasn't having any fun. Next time you play hard, try this. Wait and wash yourself after you're all through. Yeah, good idea. I'll give it a try. So, do you think it's new ball game time? Sure is. Spooky, don't you think it's time that you washed up? Why should I do that? I can just huh? shake it off like oh. this. Ah, you're filthy. Get away. <laughs> I'm the mud monster. Go you away, mud escape my monster. Mud. Go away. <laughs> <laughs> Mystery Mail. Hi, Jin. Good morning. <laughs> oh? Good morning. Hello, Hello Posey. Posey. Wow, you're here early today. I have a delivery for Hallie. You do? Here you go. <laughs> so many letters. <laughs> All right. <laughs> It seems you've been waiting for these. Remember that time Posty brought all those letters for Polly? I was so jealous, wasn't I, Posty? You sure were. I'm just glad that my job makes people happy. Is there some mail for me? Not today. There's not? Hmm. Well, goodbye. Bye, Bye Posty. Posty. Oh, I wish I got some mail. La, 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 la. Here's Posty. Uh, I wonder what we have today. Suspect? Ah, who is that? Ah. You scared me. Why are you hiding back here? I'm trying to solve a case. A case? Yeah. Huh. By chance, have you ever seen anyone put a blue letter in that mailbox over there? No, I have not. A blue letter, you say? The sender never addresses the envelope, so I can't send it. Hmm. Hmm. Is that all? I thought your case was something serious. It is serious. I can't deliver the mail without the proper address. You know that the mail must go through. Yes, it must. Uh, Posty, while you're here, could you please keep an eye out for Dump? For Dump? Yes, he's bringing me new tires. Would you mind? No. No. Huh? Oh. Huh? Mr. Builder. Let's see. <sighs> Mm -hmm. Blue letter, blue letter, blue letter. <sighs> uh, no, it's not <sighs> him. Oh. oh, come on. Oh, no mail. Oh, well, I guess it wasn't that long ago that Posty was here last. Oh. Then what happened? Uh -huh. Well, then huh? I caught him and let him down really carefully. Good job. <laughs> Jin! Hi, guys. What was that story that Hallie was just telling? He was telling <laughs> us about one of the letters he received. Oh, yeah? What was in it? They're all thank you letters for Hallie. They're from friends he's helped. It's all for small stuff, like rescuing a kitten from a treetop or bringing back a balloon that got away. <laughs> Sometimes they even send pictures that they drew. That's so nice, Hallie. Oh, no, huh? Jin. You look like you're about to cry. I don't know. You always get so many letters, but I never get anything. I guess nobody thinks about me. Uh. <sighs> 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 I must have fallen asleep. <sighs> huh? What's this? <gasps> A blue letter! I found the suspect! Hey, you! Stop right there! Get out of 
out of the way. Uh, there he is! Hold on, little boy! <laughs> Wait, I want to talk to you! Huh? Posty, watch out! That sounded real bad. <laughs> huh? Oh. Ah. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. Oh. Posty. Mr. Wheeler, Dump was trying to avoid yeah. hitting me. We can talk about this later. Right now, I'm going to call the rescue team. It's Jin speaking. Huh? Oh, yes. Well, what happened? Emergency! Emergency! Dump got into an accident near Mr. Wheeler's store. All members, please move out to Mr. Wheeler's. Okay. okay. Holy, I need help. We're here, Dump. We'll help you right away. Helly, can you block off the road, please? I'm on it. Roy and Amber, help him up. Got, Got it. <laughs> you two, we have this under control. Why don't you move to a safer place? Good sure, idea. no problem. What's going on? It's all right. You'll have to go around, though. Okay. Let's go. I'm so sorry. Oh, be more careful next time. Uh, By the way, I hope you find the person who's sending the blue letters. Yeah, me too. Well, Amber and I will head back to headquarters. Right. Ready, Amber? Let's go. <laughs> chased after that boy, this wouldn't have happened to Dump. And the case still isn't solved. It's all right, mm -hmm. Posty. <laughs> Dump will turn out fine. And we can help you track down the boy who's been sending all of those blue letters. You will? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks a lot. But it might be hard work. I don't even know who that boy is. Yeah? Well, tell us what he looks like. Well? He was just a regular kid with black hair and glasses. Is there anything else that you recall? Um... Ah! He was wearing a uniform, and there was a yellow ribbon on his chest. Great! Mm -hmm. I'm sure those clues will make it much <laughs> easier to find him. Yeah. You're sure? This is where he lives? Yep. <laughs> this is it. But how did you find him? We asked Scooby about him. Scooby knows every single kid who lives in Broomstown. That's right. We told Scooby what you remembered about him. A little boy, black hair, and glasses. Oh, it's Ryan. He just moved here to Broomstown last month. He goes to kindergarten. That's what he told us. So we went to the school and we got his address. Awesome! You two are great. At this. We did all right. <laughs> <laughs> so, should we go see Ryan now? Who is it? Huh. <sighs> Hello, Hello, Ryan. Ryan. We're the Broomstown Rescue Team. And my name's Posty. Wow, the rescue team's here at my house. Nice to meet you. And nice to meet you, Posty. Welcome to Broomstown. <laughs> Actually, we're hoping you can help solve a special case. What case? Well, are you the one who wrote these letters? <gasps> My letter. I did write it, but why do you have it? Ryan, the problem is, I can't deliver a letter without an address on it. Address? What's an address? The address is the place where you want the mail to be delivered. Other 
Otherwise, oh. your friends won't receive your letters. Are you mm -hmm. sure? Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Like this. You put your name and address up here in this corner, and your friend's information goes down here. And up here is where you put the stamp. I get it. But I don't even know the lady's name who I wanted to send the letter to. Well, what can you tell us about the lady you're talking about? Let's see. It was the day after I moved here. I went for a ride on my bike, but then it broke. Oh, I can't fix it. <laughs> and then this lady in an orange outfit came up to me. It looks like you're having some bike trouble. Let me take a look. She was so smart, she fixed huh? my bike in no time. You're all set. Wow. Ride carefully now, all right? <laughs> oh, hold on. Miss, she was gone so quickly that I never even got a chance to thank her. Well, I know where you can find her. Me too. <laughs> oh, but who is it? Wow, all of these are addressed to me? They sure are. Good, Good work, work, Jin. Jin. That's great, but who's Ryan? You'll know when you read them. But you should know that those letters went through a lot to make it here. Really? I can't wait to read them. Thank you, Posty. It's all just part of my job. There's a lot of mail waiting for me today. Goodbye, Goodbye Posty. And thanks again. <laughs> Sometimes I really love my job. This is why. Harmony of Broomstown, Part 1. Uh, hmm. uh, okay. It's done. Huh? Good, Good morning. morning. Good morning. What are you working on so early? Ta-da! <laughs> A, A new, new choir? choir? What's the deal with this chorus anyway, Jin? Yeah, what's going on here? <laughs> I know what's going on here. The next town over won first place in the choir competition, right? That's it. Amber, you're really smart. Since they won, they've been invited to perform in big cities and meet famous musicians. So oh. why shouldn't we try? We could be the ones singing on all the big stages. So why don't we? We'll never know for sure if we don't at least give it a try. Am I right? Oh, I like it. I think it would be a lot of fun if we had a choir here in Broomstown. Yes, it could be a good experience for everyone. All right, sounds good to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hey, if people do try out, once we have a choir, we should perform for the whole town. Great idea. We can have a celebration premiere concert. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Now let's get the word around town. Right. Hello. Residents of Broomtown announcing the formation of a new town choir. Debuting soon in a celebration premiere concert. If you are interested in singing with us, please sign up to audition. Audition for the choir? A concert? Mm-hmm. You guys really should sign up. Okay. Can I sign up even if I don't sing so well? Sure. Anyone who likes music is welcome to come try out. Can kids sign up too? Of course. <laughs> Hooray! That's great! Indeed. <laughs> and there will be a big celebration premiere concert as well. You should really sign up. Okay, we'll be there. I'm the best singer in town. No way I'm missing this. No way! Huh? I'm the best singer in town. No, I am. Oh, I wow, so. really competitive. I am. Oh, I feel like my smile will never stop when I'm cleaning with my rolling mop. Cleanie. Cleanie. Huh? Hi. Hi, guys. Cleanie, you heard about the choir auditions, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we just finished signing up. Did you sign up yet? Mm -hmm. Uh, no, not yet. We could all sing on stage. You should totally audition for this, Cleanie. I'll <laughs> think about it. We'll see you later. <laughs> okay, bye, you guys. It'd be fun. Should I audition? But then, I'm not sure I could ever sing in front of others. Oh. I guess I'll call it a day. Jin. Huh? Cleanie. Did you come to sign up? Well, yes. 
I wasn't oh. sure at first, <laughs> but... Wonderful, Queenie. It's going to be a great experience. Is it really? <laughs> Did a lot of people sign up? Well, Queenie signed up at the end of the day, but there weren't as many people as I'd hoped. Oh, really? But everybody seemed so enthusiastic. Yeah, the response was great. <laughs> well, that's good to hear. <laughs> hey, I just remembered I picked out a conductor for the choir. Who is it? Why, it's Amber. Wow, wow. go Amber. Amber is an awesome choice. Yep. Thank you. I'll try hard. <laughs> you know, I had an idea. In addition to auditioning singers, we should audition people who can play instruments as well. Great idea, Amber. Because some of the people I talked to were worried they can't sing that well. It would be great to have singers and instruments performing together. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am just so excited for tomorrow's audition. Me too. <laughs> Just do like we practiced and you'll be fine. When I get this sign, we all sing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> la, 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 la. My name is Cat. No. Hey, let's start, Bully. We'll start soon. Just hang on. Mm. Are you ready? Yes. The first auditioner is Spooky. <laughs> Welcome. Hello. Spooky, are you ready to sing something? Yep. Check, check. Three little bears living in the forest. Papa oh. bear, mama <laughs> bear, baby bear. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Who's the nicest, fastest car? Who? <gasps> Who could take you really far? <laughs> Who? I'm Cap. This is my rap. Zip, zip, zip. Head, shoulders, knees, and tires, knees, and tires. <laughs> okay, next is the little trio. Hi, Hi everyone. everyone. Hello. Are you ready? Yes. yes. One, two, Jack, Jack, Jack Rabbit. Rabbit. That's wrong. Let's uh, start over. You didn't count to three. Yes, I they did. They did it right earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Be it ever so humble, there's wow. no Scooby place is quite like good. home. Yes. You put your right tire in, you put your right tire out, you put your right Both tire Scooby in. Both Scooby and Posty are really good. You do the hokey pokey and you turn yourself around. That's what Cleanies it's next. all about. <laughs> you must be nervous. Oh, everyone's so well prepared. I think I should just give up. Queenie! Oh. Where are you going? It's your turn next. Well, I'll be right back. Queenie? Huh? Last but not least is Queenie! Huh? Where is he? But he was just out there. Why don't we just wait for him? Oh, what am I doing? I got scared and I just left. Oh. Hmm, Queenie's really late. Did he just mm -hmm. get too nervous oh. and decide to leave? <gasps> when I saw him, he did look awfully nervous. When we called Cleanie's name, he just ran away. Mm -hmm. I see. What if we went and found him? He can audition from anywhere. Cleanie deserves a chance at oh. this. I think he really wants mm -hmm. to sing. That's a great idea. We'll go and encourage Cleanie. We'll make sure he gets his chance to try out for the choir. Great! great. And so, time to move out. <laughs> Go back? I can't. Oh, goodness! They must be looking for me! Oh, I better hide! Back yet? Cleanie? Cleanie! Huh? 
Hey, guys, over there. Shh. <laughs> about the audition. I guess I ran away. I'm just too shy to sing in front of everybody. Okay, but don't you still want to try to be a part of the choir? Yes, it'll be lots of fun. If you want to sing in the choir, then be brave. Yeah, Cleanie, at least try. You're going to be great. <laughs> oh, thank you all. But the audition is finished. It's too late. I don't think so. You can do your auditioning right now. So then, mm -hmm. you guys put together a small stage for our friend to sing on, okay? All right! <laughs> then, Cleanie's audition starts now. <sighs> beat, beat, beat the drum. Keep a steady beat. Rappity, pappity, tappity, tum. Drums are really neat. <laughs> uh, how's that? That was mm. wonderful, Cleanie. Mm -hmm. I didn't know you were so multi talented. Good, Good job. job. <laughs> so, on snare drum, Cleanie. Oh, thank you, Amber. And on the bass drum, Spooky. <laughs> Cap on cymbals. Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> Dump on horns. Thank you, Amber. And our singers, Schoolby and Posty. I'll try hard. hard. I'll try harder. And then our backup singers, Minnie, Rody, Benny, Max, and finally, Bruner. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> Everyone, welcome to the Broomstown Choir. Thank you, Amber. Wow, everybody got a part. That's how Amber does it. People, our first performance date is set. It's in two weeks, and our rehearsals start tomorrow. Just listen to Amber, and I know you'll be great. I'm so excited. We're excited, too. <laughs> We're going to be famous. <laughs> Harmony of Broomstown, Part 2. Let's put up the stage over there. Great! Great. If this works out like we've been planning, this will be one amazing stage. Yeah. I wonder how choir rehearsal is going, since it's the very first one. It is, and I'm sure that it's going very well. could sing a little quieter so everybody else can hear better? No, I can barely hear myself because Posty is so loud. You're louder than I am. No, I'm not. <laughs> Calm down. We'll work all of these little problems out. Friends, you know what the coolest part of choral singing is? It's called harmony. Harmony? Different sounds come together in balance and make rich, beautiful music. We all make different sounds? Mm-hmm. It'll start to make sense as we sing more. But this is our first practice, so let's just relax and sing through the song again. Okay. Scooby, posty, cleany are my friends. There. The first practice is over. Super, Super job. job! So do you feel that the rehearsal went well? I don't know. Scooby and Posty were both singing so loud that my ears are still hurting like crazy. That's because it's the first day. I know it's going to get better. We'll see. <laughs> hey, how is the stage construction coming along, you guys? Oh, it's sweet. We're giving it our very best. Yes, yes. it'll be great. <laughs> Hearing that makes me want to practice even harder. <laughs> Amber, 
there? You can't just huh? hit the drum anytime mm. you want to. Huh? But why not? It's really fun. <laughs> You're going to ruin the entire show. I think I should be playing the bass drum. No way. The bass drum's mine. You had your chance. <sighs> Settle down. Huh? Spooky, I will look at the music and tell you exactly when to play the drum. All you have to do is watch my baton, okay? Okay. Huh? <laughs> wow. Dumba. Wow. Dumba. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Jin, is there some kind of problem? Hmm? To think of it, I yeah. haven't seen Amber. Well, this morning, both Scooby and Posty said that they were going to drop out of the choir. What? what? Wait, what are you talking about, Jin? Honestly, practices haven't been going very well at all. Cap and Spooky are always fighting over the bass drum. Posty and Scooby have oh. argued since day one. That's oh. terrible. Amber must be really upset. <sighs> Do you think Amber will be able to resolve this? I hope. Oh. Friends, <laughs> let's just make up and get back to singing. All right, if you apologize. No way! I'm not the one who sings too loud! Oh, yeah? Huh? Amber, I'm sorry, but I don't think I can sing with Scooby. Now, goodbye! <laughs> Posty! Well, I can't sing with you either. But, but, guys, listen to me! Wow, it looks great. I'm hitting it. Huh? No way. <laughs> Bass drum's mine. I'm playing it. Huh? Huh? Stop it, Cap. No, it's uh, mine. Oh. Huh? You guys ruined the stage. Huh? Uh, what do we do? Let's get out of here. Wait up. Here. Well, Spooky and Cap were fighting over the bass drum, and... Have we heard anything at all from Amber yet? No, nothing. But wait, what about the performance? Who knows? Uh, huh? Amber, what's going on? Jin, I think we're going to have to cancel the performance. Why do you say that? I couldn't get Scooby and Posty to make up. And worse, Spooky and Cap were fighting over the bass drum, and they ruined the whole huh? stage. They what? I am really very sorry, but can you please let everybody know that the celebration premiere concert is canceled? Amber? I can't Amber? believe any of this. Amber? People are going to be so disappointed to hear that the concert's off. That's right. We've all done so much hard work. Isn't there another way? Polly, we still have some time. What if we gathered all of the choir members together? Yes, and I think we also have enough time to get the stage put back together. But how can we get Scooby and Posty to get along? I'm not sure, but I think if we just tell both of them exactly what's happening, they'll come around. Yes, if they know they're letting Amber down, then they just might change their minds. Good. While Roy and I start work on the broken stage, you and Helly track down our squabbling friends. Right! Let's roll! Move out! <laughs>
I'll get the instruments squared away. You take care of the stage equipment. All right. Now then, why don't you two make up and head back to the stage? The, the stage, stage is, is ruined. ruined. No, it's not. Mm -hmm. Holy and Roy are fixing mm -hmm. it up right now. Oh, what a relief. So you're in? Yes. <laughs> oh, did the performance really get canceled because of us? Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Amber got so disappointed, she gave uh -huh. up. Hosty, I apologize. Let's just go back and sing. No, no. I should apologize. I'm sorry. Hey, huh? you guys just made up. Uh -huh. Yes. Hmm? Ooh. The stage is ready to go. Good work. <laughs> hey, guys. Huh? Here oh. we are. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome back. back. <laughs> now we just have to find Amber. <sighs> we all worked really hard. It might not have worked out, but practicing was really fun. Huh? Amber, can I ask you to come back down to the stage? What's happening, Polly? You'll find out. Oh, all right. Huh? <laughs> You're here? <laughs> Welcome, Amber! Amber, I apologize for giving you a hard time. Me too. We won't ever fight over the bass drum again. Uh-huh. So cheer up. Cheer up, Amber. Thank you, everybody. Now, I will never give up. And thank you all for pulling together so much. You're, You're welcome. welcome. Okay, let's get ready to show the audience our awesome performance. Is everyone ready? Yes! yes. 